What's your preference, Pat? Hmm. You said we got one mission, or we got enough for one star tonight. Do you want to do a side mission, or do you want to continue with the storyline? Don't matter to me. Don't matter to you none. Technically, you just said it doesn't matter to him. Not that it doesn't I matter added to him. the one, yes. How dare you? Aaron, Aaron likes gun. Mm-hmm. I mean, we did just open up three new ones, right? Yep. And then we still got all the other side ones that we haven't done? Yep. All those things are true. Don't matter to me. Don't matter to you. Okay. What you feeling like? Kind of want to knock out that main storyline for now. All right. Sure. So 37, 38, or 39? Yes. The middle one. 38. 38. So slave pens. Slave pens it is. Gasgag is slave stuff on. <laughs> God's gonna get his slave free declaration. Oh, I need to shut the door and turn on a light. I cleaned my computer today. Ooh. There's lots of dust in it. I would imagine. Basically, just been suffering and overheating this whole time. <laughs> well,. I don't know. It was mostly my CPU, red, and a lot of the outside fans. My graphics card had very little dust in it. Okay. So, yeah. Oh, my CPU cooler. Hoofed. <laughs> All right, so city. Uh, yes, we need to add eight cards to it. You are awakened in, in your room by a decisive knock at the door. You answer to find a man in the robes of the Great Oak. Greetings, the man begins. Our sanctuary is having a bit of trouble, and I've been directed to you as a persons as persons who could possibly help. You see, some of our relics have gone missing, and we suspect the worst. We are hoping to, you might grace us with your assistance in investigating this matter. Agree to help the priest and accompany him to the sanctuary, or refuse to help, making some excuse about being too busy. Sounds like a scenario, question mark? Probably. Sounds like. That's or he'll just like, we need money. Give us money. I've been giving you so much you money. Proper person. I am the sunkeeper. Sunkeeper would be probably the one to do it. So <laughs> yeah, go for it. We got where we're going. Uh, so the pious man seems incredibly happy. As uh, seems incredibly happy. You decided to help the sanctuary. When you arrive at the great building, he explains in detail all that has happened. Using that information, you inquire around town, putting in our feelers, putting out feelers to possible to possible fences for the goods. So we need a scoundrel, a mine thief, a night shroud, a sawbones, or a sous singer. Nope. We have none of those. Otherwise, no effect. Cards okay. gone. So we will <clears throat> never add City Event 65 to the deck. Bum, bum, ba, da. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, we had the Sun Keeper. Like, that should have been what it was. But no, you need either someone that's good at stealing or someone that's good at talking to people. Well, it's because you're looking for the stolen stuff. So you need someone with contacts to the underground. Well, yeah, but... I don't know. Sometimes it's just random feeling as to what you need. Like, sometimes yeah. it's obvious. Like, hey, you're going to go tracking through the woods. You clearly need the Doomstalker <laughs> or someone else like it. So then this one, it's like, hey, the church is asking you for help because they had some trouble with their relics. Because somebody came and stole their stuff. So make sure you have a thief character. Yeah, because you need to find out where the stuff went. Or you... Sunkeeper doesn't know where that shit went off to. They're not investigators. But they're blessed by God. I don't know. Yeah. No. <laughs> I mean, makes more sense than like the sooth singer or the sawbones. Yeah, why the sawbones? But, uh, I don't know. It's just what it said. That is weird. Probably, what... probably, like, probably because he was a doctor, so he's like taking care of. Because it's just putting out feelers. Mm. So maybe he's got some kind of underground connections because people he's helped in the past. Mm. I didn't read into the sawbones backstory. 
Well, the elementalist has, you know, connections to the magical, so he would know people around town that would know about magical relics being fenced. <laughs> Does it, it doesn't matter too much. The card that we missed out was basically a reputation gain card. Ah. So. All right, then. Since we weren't going to be getting it anyways, I went and looked at it. Yep. Um, Everyone good from Gloomhaven? Or good. If... Everyone's good to leave Gloomhaven. Yep. Yeah. That's the words that I was saying. What words you were trying to say, at least. All right. So, out on the road. You're enjoying a pleasant, peaceful stroll down the road when you find yourself suddenly surrounded by a beleaguered group of men. One of them steps forward, a pox covering half his face. Good day to you, he smiles weakly. We hate to be a burden, but you see, my camp has taken ill with a strange malady and we must kindly beg you for some money for medicine. We look around to see if, to see that some disfiguring disease has indeed come over the lot of them. The man scratches the side of his face with one hand while he slowly pulls out his sword with the other. I'm afraid we can't take no for an answer. Option A, fight off the men. This is a highway, this is highway robbery. Blah, blah, blah. This is highway robbery, whatever the motive. Or option B, pay the men and be on your way. I get to start the snare with poison again. Or we can just pay if you got money. I don't want to spend I money. I don't want to spend money on them. Okay, so I'm guessing we're fighting them. <laughs> Alright, so do we have the play, Harold? We do not. Alright. The men are weakened, but they are still hardened fighters. You fight them off, but it gets ugly. I'll start poisoned, and I'll start with three damage. If we had had the Plague Herald, uh, the Plague Herald stretches out his arms and the men around him immediately double over in pain. You can almost sense it smiling, even though it doesn't have a face. The fight doesn't last long, especially once the men's wounds start bursting with maggots. I'll start with scenario with one damage. So, oh, but, because he had to hurt us to yeah, do he, it, he, he, he did a big... He did an area. And then if we paid him... Uh, then we either paid them five gold each or we do the top. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Okay. So. So that's three damage. And that's it. Gloomhaven doesn't. Well, not too Gloomhaven. Uh. <laughs> what? Uh, no, Tip top simulator no longer. Tip top simulator no longer likes me pressing the buttons on my mouse. I can't change anything with those buttons anymore. Hmm. Hey, your mouse needs to be updated. No, because it works. It works outside of tabletop. I'm just it's not in tabletop. I mean, I guess it depends on what you were trying to do with the buttons, which is like changing typing, the number buttons, like to change the numbers. Health. Changing like the the health and drawing cards and stuff like that, I could do, which mm. I used to always be able to do. So I don't know. Mm. Um, I just was thinking it's more the mouse update than it might be, you know, but it, that it, the, the mouse know, isn't the mouse isn't communicating to tabletop what it, it, it's doing. But on Discord, I can press it and it puts in the numbers. I didn't say it wasn't talking to the computer. I said it wasn't talking to tabletop. But, you know, you're the computer guy. Mm-hmm. <laughs> all right. So, requirements none. Goal, kill all enemies and pr pr protect the orchid, so protect me. I'm an orchid. Uh... This section of the forest is a maze of thorns and angry spirits, Hale says, pointing to the second location on the map. You'll never find the corruption on your own. You'll need a guide. Someone who knows the Digger Forest better than they know themselves. There's a group of native orchids that may be able to help. When you arrive at the orchid camp, however, you find something wholly unexpected. It is a scene of massacre and devastation. Burned out buildings and disfigured corpses. Judging from the wounds, you figure a raiding party of Enox did this. Luckily, Enox don't find feel a particular need to cover their tracks. You are able to follow their trail deeper into the woods, where eventually you find a slave labor camp. Enoch's guards overseeing a group of ragged orchids and, hu and humans working to construct catapults and other machines of war. 
the camp is not particularly well guarded from intruders, and after eliminating a couple key lookouts, you are able to slip into the slave pens and free one of the orchids. Yes, I can guide you through the deeper forest, the orchid says, but I cannot abandon my brethren, or let what or let what these Enochs are doing go unanswered. He moves over to the guard's corpse and picks up a blade. Picks up a blade. You can help me if you want, but either way, blood must be spilled in this place. The orchid rushes forward at a group of Enochs, yelling wildly. Soon the whole camp is bustling with hostile activity. If you want to if you want a guide, it looks as though you'll need to keep him alive. Special rules. Orchid A, yes, represented please. by a number Represented by a numbered token, has six plus three times level hit points. So, we're still on four. So, 27. 18. 27. Don't know how I came up with that number. Uh, I thought some. Um, I, I don't know. Forget it. <laughs> 18. Uh, he is an ally to you. He's an ally to you and an enemy to all monster types. He acts on initiative 99 each round, performing move three toward the shaman on the D tile opening doors and springing traps if necessary. If the orchid is killed, the scenario is lost. Great. All right. Another protect the hail. Protect the hail. <laughs> Except this one moves faster. Yeah. Well, it we also attack. move faster, too. No. no. Why the fuck did they pick up a sword? I don't know. It just moves. Move three. Maybe he's trying to deliver the sword. I, I guess. Here, shaman, have the sword. Here, kill me with this. It'll go much faster. Everyone's to keep ready to keep on the move. What's that? I said I hope everyone's ready to keep on the move. How far? How fast does he move? Three. Uh, three. Yeah, not a chance. I guess I'll swap out some of my cards. This is where That's the Craig card comes into play. You can make winding paths and make her go around. Certainly, an option. Yes. Go here. You can move it my so way he, if you need so some. Yeah. What was it that he does? He just charges the shaman. Yeah. Was what he said? Yeah. Goes. Yep. Uh, so this is the detail. Yes. So just know that he's heading there. Fun. Gonna kill everything and protect the orca. Okay. Why did you lock that? I was trying to unlock the tile you locked. Oh. So I can move it up. <laughs> yes. So you already grabbed all four dudes. There are some damage traps. There's a treasure tile. There is some damage traps. I will say that Tabletop does not like uh, my number pad for some reason. Yeah, on my mouse I can set it to whether it's the number pad or the key row. So, uh, okay. is it on the I key have row it, right now? I have it set to the key row. Oh, okay. Yeah, I can't. I can't use the num. Yeah, numpad doesn't work. It's yeah. I tried messing with the switch to make sure that wasn't it either to make any difference. Nope, didn't want that. Put that back. Opticals. All right. 
I've got about doors. Doors would help. One they're, second. Typ they're typically doors. So you still work tomorrow, then come up after work? Talking to me? Yes. Uh, no, we're not coming up till Saturday. Oh, that's right, you're leaving Saturday. It's gonna be, yeah. That's right, you're coming up Saturday, going back Monday. Going late with Isaac, he ends up getting tired at about 9 o'clock, and then does not want to travel. And usually there's about an hour left at that point, so... Mm. That's the best time to travel, then they just sleep. Uh, yeah. After we, also, we used to we always travel up when, when, when Watson was ready to go to bed, whenever it was a longer trip, because I was like, yeah, he'll just sleep. Yeah, That's if it's the ideal way. If it's like a nap time in the middle of the afternoon or whatever, he'll sleep, but if it's the one late at night, he doesn't like it. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't know. Alright. So what you're saying is I should probably bring some heels with, just in case. Yeah. Or just do my job better. Well, that might just be hard due to speed issues. What do you mean speed issues? Yeah, this, I was talking about movement. Mm. Might have to actually bring along Flight of Flame. I'm just going to try and keep it up. Or we'll probably more likely die somewhere around here. Oh, wait, you've got heels, don't you? Me? Kyle. I have some heels, sure. Why? That one in. I think. Ooh. Probably remove this one then. Okay. Well, if you mobilize the guards, he can't go anywhere. Until we clear him, yeah. Or just stand next to them so they don't move. Mm -hmm. Aaron! Yeah. That's your job. Alright, I will bring a heal with, just in case. My first turn is going to be healing, so... Oh, for the poison? Yeah. Poison, damage... Oh yeah, we did take some damage, didn't we? Mm-hmm. Three damage. In that case, maybe the... Wow, well, the other one's only a heal one. This one's a heal three. So... <sighs> oh. All right, long day already, or what? All right, I'm ready. Aaron's not. He's going to go faster than me anyways. What's the matter? I don't need to do it right away, so I'll do that. Okay. 14. 13. 41. 15. And they're going 15. <laughs> With a shield. And poison attack. But they're not yeah. moving. Yep. Uh, so I will... Start off doing my expose. Excuse me, two, three. Again, the mouse buttons don't work. Um, and then I will doom the elite. I will then activate my ring of brutality. Dude. Uh, let's go with fresh kill. So it's a 2-2-2, two, 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 so 6 base damage. Um, he is undamaged, so I will gain XP. And I get uh, advantage, so plus 1, or add target. Uh, 
both, so I will also be attacking guard three. So guard one took seven damage. Okay. Guard three will start with a base two and minus two, so zero damage. I'm going to be base four because he is also... Oh, he is also on damage. I forgot I did that card. So how much was Thank it again? Uh, there'll be two damage then. Two damage. Because I, I pulled a minus two. Okay. Oh, Kyle. Uh, do you, you... You should tell me when you want fire. You got a okay. fire wand. Oh. Okay. I, didn't, I don't have anything else to do with my hands, so... Mm -hmm. If you are like, hey, I need an element, I'll be like, okay. Okay. Because uh, usually I'll be going before you anyways, so... Yeah. Now the guards are going to go there and attack me for... The elite one's going to attack me for three. Why did you move up? Why did I move up? Let's not move up. Mm -hmm. It's like they're not moving. Up. You can just let them hit nothing. Okay, so then they go just get the shield and then Kyle's turn. Because I like to face tank and use my retaliation. <laughs> Good job. I mean, right. if you have retaliate, you can. But so I'm going to use the sun, generate the sun, heal myself two separate times for three, and going to use that to recover one of my discard cards. So. All right. End of the round, this little thingy goes one, two. Light waits, fades, wanes, fades, wanes. Wanes, waning. Wanes world. Wanes world. Wanes world. Wanes world. But to answer your question, yes, it has been a long day. After we played last night, I think we stopped about midnight. Something mm -hmm. like that. And I probably didn't actually fall asleep till, I don't know, not a decent time, probably like one. <laughs> oh. I'm ready. I am as well. I'm just looking at what I can do. Let me know if you need that fire. Fire just doesn't do a ton. Usually fire is more damage for you. Or it is. Wounds. So. Yeah, I mean, I have some things. My, my choices were the light, the nature, or, or earth, or the fire. We don't mm -hmm. have... I would have done the ice if possible, because I like the ice abilities of his. Yeah, like the but, stuns and stuff. Yeah, but we don't have that wand. That wasn't an option. Um, Tiring yeah. Characters. Fire would probably be pretty useful. This turn? Yeah. Will do. I've got a, I've got a good target for it. Okay. Flip it. 56. 10. They are shielding again. Cool. Exact same thing. Not that Except great. Except this though. time they'll be able to hit that guy. Yep. One of them. Uh, well, I'm going to take out the elite. So I'm going to start with plus three on all my attacks against doomed people. And then I'm going to do a two plus three plus two plus three. So ten advantaged attack. So uh, I guess one, you've got the elite plus doomed. One. Yeah, at, uh, at this point I don't get to choose. The mm -hmm. elite dies. Yeah, I was going to say, well, if we could kill. I would like to, but that's not really an option. Okay. So then the guard. Oh, and then I also generate fire. Okay. Guard's gonna whack her for or him for three, four damage. I'm gonna say her a get lot. Poisoned. Yeah. Why not? He could be poisoned. Okay. I don't know. All right. Now it's my turn. I'd prefer it if he didn't, but he does. Uh, at the end of the turn. She's going to open up a thing, and then everybody's going to... Unless you go into the door. One, two, three. Yeah. Okay. We're opening the door. We need an elite 
golem and two regular archers. Oh good, they already have a showing planned tomorrow for my house. <sighs> is that actually a good thing? I, it is, other than it, I need to make sure that it's ready tonight to be yeah. shown. Where originally it was going to be like Saturday for the open house. Because mm-hmm. when you said that, like, like it seems like it would be a good thing because you're trying to sell the house and then you're like... Mm-hmm. It was so downtrodden that I was like, this doesn't seem like it's a good thing. It's It's got potential to not be a great thing. <laughs> well, this It's little, a good thing, it just requires work. This fucker's gonna be making traps and yeah. So to prevent him from laying a trap there, I'm gonna use my boots and go there. Yeah, stop uh, him from making a wall of traps. Yep. And then I'll attack archer number three. Four. Let's see, so it'd be five, six oh, damage. So it's hot everywhere. Well, then it's a really good thing I said that we were only doing one scenario. What's that? In fact, they got to clean up for the house. Oh, yeah. I mean, I've got it, you know, 99% of the way there, always. Mm-hmm. Of course, I was kind of planning on working from home tomorrow, but. Okay, um, so then the archer's gonna go because oh wait yeah archer's gonna go because they got fourteen. Um, number three will take a step back. Number four, let's see, we three movement. Can he, can he get away from me? No. So three will attack. Well, he won't anyways because uh, three would go and lay down a trap. Oh, never mind. He only has two movement. Uh, anyway, so they're attacking me for two damage. So nothing, and the other one is going to do disadvantage for two damage, which gets blocked, and there's no trap for the number four to leave, so cool. Uh, Now the guard is going to go and attack that chick again for five damage. And then he gets shield, and Kyle, what are you, like, 50-something? Okay, and then the golem's gonna go. Golem's got Wait, four. who just hit him? The guard. Didn't the guard already go this no. guard no, no, already last turn. Yeah, the guard already went at 15. Oh. Yeah. Why was I thinking? Okay. Because uh, you went. Because you, you saw the archer was 14. Ah, there we go. Okay. Uh, and, then, and then the golem's yeah. gonna go. <clears throat> I was like, how did he get attacked again? So then the plus one's coming my way. Cool. Uh, seven damage. So two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then the golem suffers damage. And the golem suffers her damage. And then it's Kyle's turn. All right. I will. Um... The golem would be nice if I didn't, if I still had the expose and could use its doom. Mm-hmm. Use it, you and all allies get pierced two against it. All right, so attacking one, the guard. Let's make sure I shuffle. A rolling ice, great. Not like I wasn't already generating that, so that's one damage and a curse against the guard. Okay. Um, he was shielded before you pulled it oh, right. away. Get the bonus shield. No. Yep. yep. All right, and then I will use the fire to attack three, poison and wound for a wind generation. So three more damage to him? Yes. Minus one for the shield. Okay. All right, and then the token's going to go one, two, three. Great spot. Well, yeah. Unfortunately, this trap is. <laughs> God damn it. like an obstacle, isn't he? Oh no, he runs through traps. That's right. Because he's retarded. But he won't. This isn't any closer to the door, so he won't. Yeah, it is. From here. Oh, compared to you. Yeah. We'll take a step back. I will. Have or, kill, to. or kill an archer. <laughs> I will try to do both. How about that? Unfortunately, three was the one I hit. I mean, will. Does he does he ignore the fact that the door is blocked? 
that he can't get to the door? As long as the archers are alive, he won't go for the door. He shouldn't have moved at all then, shouldn't he? Mo mo um, performing move three towards the shaman on opening, or on D. I think he just moves. He doesn't... Yeah, it's it's not so much of a focus type thing. It's the, the, the monster movement is weird. Or the, the ally movement. Because they're not focused... Like they, they, they have a focus of the room, but they still move towards it. Oh, okay. As far as I, I can... Sure. And clarify. I don't know. I don't know how any of this works. According to Marcel, which is the one who made it. The NPC tries to get as close as possible to the shaman in the last town, otherwise it behaves like a monster focused without an attack. So, since he's focusing that tile, Kyle's right, I don't think it actually moves. Because even with infinite movement, he can't get through through the... Because uh... then he went to move the first turn either. The first turn? When the guards were blocking the door. Correct. He went to move into range to get attack. So he won't have any damage yet, and he would be farther back. Yep. And even when the next room was revealed, he still wouldn't have moved, because the, the archers were still blocking. Yep. So he would still be in the first space, with full health. That seems much more manageable. I don't know, I mean, it makes sense. That's mm -hmm. the way we've been doing monster movement so far. Mm -hmm. I guess they could have ally movement to be different, but... Overly complicated? <laughs> Question mark. Okay. All right. Well, if that's the case, then I'm going to focus on this guard. Well, fuck. I mean, unless you want to go help. But he's really far away. All right. All right if you want to focus the guard, I'll go to the next room. It doesn't really matter who I really target. I mean, how about, how about I do jump. both? How about I do, do this? That. And I do... Wait, oh, I played on. that card. Damn it. Um, let's do this one. Well, no, he's already As there. far as possible to be closer. What? Question would be how he reacts if he is blocked and by that. I mean, if there's no path in which he could reach the shaman even with unlimited movement. So right now, with unlimited movement, he could not make it there. Correct. And then Marcel's response is he moves as far as possible to be closer. He's especially annoying if he opens a room with new monsters. But So he does move. He does bum rush the trap. Or trap gets as close as possible. But then again, then he says right after that that it's... He tries to get as close as possible to the shaman in the last tile... Yep. And otherwise it behaves like a monster focus without an attack. Otherwise, as in, if he's standing next to the shaman? Or is that in regards to moving around traps and stuff? Like, he'll treat traps as obstacles if he can, otherwise he'll move through them. Is that what he means? Let's just make a decision. I would say we it. 
I'm gonna keep moving. <laughs> I mean, like, thematically, he should be moving forward because he's like, either you follow me or not, and then he runs off. Yeah, okay. Sure. So now he's in the doorway. Yes, yeah. Cool. Okay. Next turn. Anyway. Uh, what card was I playing? Oh, yeah. I was playing that one. Well. So what was your plan with the golems? What are you guys killing? Or... I'm coming up to try and hit, but... Otherwise, I'm going to... I can't was... doom, and, doom and move, so... Okay, I'll stun it then. I'm probably going to come into the room and stun something. Uh, Whatever is stunned that's... when I get there. I'm going to stun it with the golem, just so it starts ticking down and doesn't hit me as hard next turn. Okay. Although... So should I focus on the guy here, then? Nah, I might have to come up and... I think I might trigger this trap. It's only this three one. damage. This, okay. this one... Because if I back up, then that thing moves forward, and I'm gonna have to trigger it anyways. Otherwise, mm -hmm. she'll get focused. So, All right. flip. Nine. Twenty-eight. Fifty-five. Twenty-nine. Eleven. They're okay. activating the retaliate. Never mind. I won't attack the golem then. <laughs> Alright, so I'm first. Yep. I'm going to start off by dooming the Enox guard. He will be taking two damage at the start of each of his turns. Okay. And then I am attacking him for four base damage. Advantaged. Hey, there's a null. But I do five damage. You do five damage, six with poison, so he will die in his turn. Perfect. Yep. Okay. Uh, another stone golem goes, gets his retaliate up. And then it's my turn. All right, well then I'm gonna move on to the trap. Take three damage. And... We only got a movement of three. Well, if I whack four, this one will be able to move. Wait, one, two, three. Ooh, interesting. I mean, whatever one you don't stun, I'll stun. Okay, so. I'll um I'll hit number four. Burning the light, generating the light for four damage. Rolling heal plus two, so six damage. Six damage, wound, and not poison. No, stun. Okay. All right. I'm going to use the wind. Boost the move. So one, two, three, four, five. Um, and then use the ice to target whatever archer you didn't stun. Number three, okay. Archer three with an attack two for three damage. All right. And stun. Okay. Next Next the archers, this one takes a tick, their stun goes away, the guard she dies. dies, and then she moves up, or he moves up. Yeah. No. I think you're just sexist. Day. <laughs> All Day. useless NPCs are women. And this falls off. Well, I think I want to get that going actually, so we'll just do, well if I pop that I'm losing that, I don't need the advantage then. Well, this could allow me to change my mind, I guess. Okay. 
I'm ready. Yep. Flip. Just waiting for Kyle. Oh. Nice. Twenty. Twenty-three. Twenty-three. Share the one, Aaron. Eighty-seven. Thirty-one. So I'm before you. Uh, so it's Kyle, Pat, then me. The archers are attacking. And archers. And the golem is attacking. Mm-hmm. Yep. Golem's attacking me. Currently. Mm-hmm. Fun. So I'll probably step and let Aaron take that hit. Perfectly valid. Yep. All right, I'm going to attack both archers for two. Uh, two damage to one, and two damage to the other one. Okay, the archers will die then. And I've generated ice and wind. Well, three is dead. And I shall take a step and generate more ice. Oh my god, which means she's going to move forward. Mm-hmm. All right. And then I will step forward, grab this coin, go invisible, and shoot the golem for three damage. No advantage. Ooh, four damage and immobilize. And a wound. Four damage, so one gets through. Immobilize and wound. Well, you kind of got me in a pickle here. Because I don't want to let her... <sighs> God damn it. What's wrong? If I leave her, because you're not next to the golem now, yeah, she's going to take the hit. Or she's going to open up the next door. Well, and yeah, she's got to open up the next she's, door. She's opening up the next door one way or another. Right right. So you might as well just hit the golem. No, I'm going to use this. I need to get that going now. And I'll stay put just to make sure I get hit by it. Um, and then I mean, I could have gotten hit by it. It just would potentially kill me. All right. <laughs> yeah. I mean, granted, I discard at that point, but six damage. You don't exactly have a whole lot of cards to nope. keep discarding. You have ten, and that's the least of any, any of us. Indeed. Whereas you get a fuck ton of cards and a ton of health. Not a ton of health. I get a decent health. Five health more than I got. Mm-hmm. Pretty significant. Mm-hmm. Nearly 50% more. Yeah, we'll do that. Okay. Let's see. That's what I meant to generate. All right. So... Uh, and then uh, let's see. The archer dies. The golem wax me for five damage, six, seven Jeez. damage, minus three, so I take four. Wait, why doesn't he do, isn't he elite? Yeah. And he hits for six. Did I say seven? Yeah, eight damage. I meant eight. Okay. Okay. And then she runs, opens the fucking door. In fact, she goes one and, step further. Mm-hmm. And she runs into a regular... Still a he. It's still it a he. Runs into a regular... Nope, shaman. That's a shaman. Oh, we found the shaman. Good. Good job, everyone. GG. And two guards. And an elite stone golem and a regular stone golem. What? I was going to say, like, oh, okay, yeah, so they're going to have a reasonable number of enemies per room because we have to deal with this idiot. Nope, nope, they're just going to... He was fucking everything. And the next one, the next door is surrounded by traps, which she will run through, or it will run through. In two turns. She's just dead. Like that's, that's just what it is. She's dead right now. Number three. 
Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, so, Shaman goes first, I think. Shaman will uh, attack two range four. Don't think it can reach me. Not without going into disadvantage. So she'll disadvantage. just Shaman will just stay put. Attack for two damage. Miss. Hey, my one curse. Okay. Good job, me. The golems. They got two movements. So that one's going to whack her for four. Three, so that's four with the poison. And then the guards get to go. Jesus Christ. All right, guards got two movement. One, one, two. Really? Oh, my God. I Great. said that, we were, that this was going to be the end. Five. Six with poison. Minus one. It's four. With poison, and she's dead. Good job. God damn it. That was quick. GG. Okay. I mean, like, what was there otherwise that we could do, though? Other than kill things faster. Well, part of the issue was... We killed one of the guards, which means she was going to run through after we were all done with our turns. But she's going to do that no matter when we kill the guards. She, she was either going to run up and get hit by both guards, or run and open the next door. Oh, crap. Did we go back to town, or are we just yeah, going right back into we it? Always, we might as well go back to town and get another city event done. Unless we get poisoned... Oh, wait. That would only affect you. <laughs> oh, I yeah. forgot, Pat. Uh, uh, Let's drop this one. I was going to have you go what? to the main mod and grab the new damage counters because they're a lot better. I mean, the, the, these will work this time. It's just at the end, we'll, we'll switch it. We'll switch it. Okay. Um, That'll be fine this time, I right. guess. Guard. 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 Yeah, we, we're going back, right? Everyone's yeah. agreed. Yep. Yeah, sure. Oh, it's that right. dying. Relaxing for the evening at the sleeping lion, a shifting, sh shifting, shifty looking man approaches you, hand outstretched. In it are a pair of pale dice with crude marks scratched on them. Greetings, friends. You look like you could stand up, stand to liven things up a bit. Careful, <laughs> you look like game. you could stand up. You're not <laughs> crippled. <laughs> I was going with the drunk. Um, oh, that's, that that would work as well. Uh, care for a quick game of bone dice with me? I'm sure we could make it interesting. His other hand pat, other hand pats a coin purse at his side. Option A: play a game with the man. It may prove to be a good time. Option B: refuse the game of dice. Sure, let's play. Before you said pats his coin purse, which is almost equally as bad, I thought it was going to be something like patting your leg. <laughs> like he pats your leg. Want to play some bone dice? So you, you said the the multi twitch shares chat, right? Or do I have to keep swapping back and forth? Oh, I guess I could. No, you you can only be in one chat at a okay, time. Okay, then I'll just join yours then. Um... So I say, just watch both chats. I'm not. Yeah, I'm just gonna have two chats up. There we go. I do. Yeah. I'm I mean, the multi is more for yes, people to that. see. So, so yeah, people be able to see both. both. Yeah. Yep. They still won't well, well, be. I really don't know how to do it. Time, right? Uh, you can actually have them both unmuted. No. It's not that advisable. Like a bad idea. Yes. Uh, anyway. Our reputation is greater than five. So we're gonna suck. You get into the game, but after a few rounds. Your enthusiasm wanes as a man displays a streak of luck that can only be described as uncanny. You leave the table empty-handed. Lose five gold each. Ow. It goes back in the deck. Yeah. You have to be Thanks, a Aaron. low reputation for that, I bet. Well, have either to, have we to have to cheat him. or we are Catch able to cheating. spot that he's cheating, yeah. Uh, so five gold, huh? Yeah. That's, that's over half my gold. Well, then you get nothing. 
You lose. Good day, sir. Lose. I said good day. I said good day. That's. <laughs> Okay, what was my strategy again? Oh, yeah, I was going to make a card swap. Murder everything. Did I want to bring a heal with? Yes, I was going to bring a heal with. Just in um, case. I don't think I have any heals or much much ado about nothing. And I'm actually going to get rid of my attack 5. Just because it does not generate light. I have a self heal. Why are you guys all weird? I mean, I guess I could also just act as a. Um, See, if Aaron had taken the other level nine card, he could put it on that guy, and then he couldn't die. Is that just something? He can't die. Uh, oh, this no. is the one where Aaron takes all the damage. Oh, Those okay. Yeah, that lines. would be really useful. That is not the deck. I think it targets one ally, doesn't it? When any ally suffers damage. Yeah, there you go. So yeah, so if any ally suffers damage, then I would just take it then. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So then you would just have to sit back while there's a Sawbones on you, healing you all the time. So that is good for escort quests, but not as good. Because then I don't have the move jump then, but... Mm -hmm. Yeah. Anywho. But anyways, road event. Road event. Grab that deck. You're feeling a tad hungry as you walk down the road. You're considering considering stopping for a meal when you come across a thicket of bushes covered in red berries. The berries look delicious, but you hesitate. They could be poisonous. Option A, eat the berries. Option B, pass by the berries and just eat your normal rations. Do not trust red berries. The berries are bad. Red berries, red berries are, are bad. always not, bad. They're not eating the berries. By not, not wanting to regret making a stupid decision, you refrain from eating the berries and continue on down the road. No effect. You randomly get stabbed in the face by a gnome. Ha ha, fools! Ah, gnome face! <laughs> if you had taken the time to eat the berries, you'd be fine, but not now. You ran oh. over. You got run over by a runaway cart. Gasp. Le gasp. Le gasp. Okay, so what is my role in this strategy? Kill, Kill shit. You know that thing you, you really realize that, No, the elementalist <laughs> is not good at killing shit, in fact. What? You're like a damage dealer. That's your one he's, job. He's kind of terrible bad at it. Like terror bad? Terror bad. Like I said, I, after playing the Quartermaster, I'm now completely spoiled. <laughs> Any other class just does not live up to it? No, it, it's it's just the best class, hands down, in every situation. There's nothing he can't handle. Uh, Even something like this, I could make like a purchase for like the heal scroll or something and just make use of that. Yeah, we didn't get anywhere near the treasure chest before. That's right. Okay, I need two guards in the we first room. We barely made it. We made it into That's the third room, and then the guy died. Set up correctly. Correction: the guy made it into the third room. We did not. Yeah, that's true. He's an ally. It counts as a we. <laughs> it's the royal we. Ah, uh, he had what eighteen health, I think. Uh, Why didn't you? Snap? Not enough. Six plus three times level, so we're level level four. Yeah, which would be eighteen. Yep. Okay, you're snapping there. Good. Now, for this to work, you guys need to be on the back line. As a post. Kyle, you haven't hit level eight. What? You haven't hit level eight. No. How did I, I have three hundred? Did I level up? I huh? retired before you. Did I? Didn't I? I did. I think so. Yes. Yeah. 
I was like, I'm almost at level eight. So that's why I was just confused about yeah, why you, you weren't there. I thought you were before me. Yeah, you were. Did you I ever get my personal quest back? I don't seem to have it in front of me. I think There's it was the kill elites one. There's only one over here. Yeah, I, I like. I think it got deleted, and then you were supposed. We were supposed to grab another one, and we didn't. Oh well. Which one was it? The kill elites, I believe. Can we do that one a long time ago? No. We have that one and the uh, the Dagger Forest one are the last two. And the Dagger Forest one was the other one that I looked at. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I don't think anybody took the Elites just because it was going to take forever. Yeah. We took the other one to get the... What is it? Not Angry Face. Two minis? Two minis. Too many. I don't know. Try to keep it as low spoiler as possible. <laughs> Oh, we can kind of talk about the angry face since it's on the board. <laughs> right. Angry face, yes. <laughs> um, am I forgetting something? We're missing just a couple stumps. Um, that's what a stump. Yeah, that's a stump. Okay. Shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. Yeah, I caught a little bit of Grapes stream. Was he just doing like a tabletop thing or was he doing a live? No, tabletop? he was doing a tabletop. Okay. It was, was a doing short the... one. Yeah, he was doing scenario one. The he's bandit. A... He's... Wasn't he doing the bandit commando? Mm -mm. I thought he not was. When I, not when I watched. Hmm. I caught him early on in the stream, so he may, may have been on long enough that he hit the, the scenario be. two also. I, I just I thought I remember the shape of the room reminded me of that. So it may not have actually been that. Um, well, that's not going to happen. No. Although, do I want to retire now? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> do you? That's what I'm wondering. For the hyper spoiler? Um, For envelope X. Titan... Is that Envelope X? Yep. I thought Envelope X was just where we got a letter from. Uh, Envelope X is the full full clue, full start of it. Oh, that's the clue. That's, that's, the, that's full, the thing that says, the hey, clue. here's what you're looking for. All this and this, yeah. Yeah. yeah it's but Envelope, Envelope X. X didn't contain the thing. No, but it is It is Envelope X. Just That's, that's how it's it, referred to. That's what it's referred mm -hmm. to. Okay. It is stupid that I just... I mean, I, I did use a descrambler, but it was just one that popped out. I was like, that seems like a fancy thing. <laughs> but I didn't realize it was one word. Well, the, I'll, yeah. I realize that now. Thank you. Yeah. Um, I was also like... What do I want to do to start out here? I think it was at Nick and Clarissa's at the time. <laughs> now we just gotta uh, figure out what. Oh, remember yeah. one's elite. Yeah, uh, that's not that one. Then it's the other one. But what if you one wasn't the elite? One. I just knew one of them was. All right. Uh, well, then number six is elite. Okay. You know, rather than permanently immobilizing him. We could just permanently disarm these guys. Oh, wait, we can't do any of that. Because we don't have the Quartermaster. But if we're just permanently disarmed, that would still be a loss of the scenario. No, the, the, the Inox guards. Yeah if, they're, yeah, if they're permanently disarmed and we just sat here for 17 rounds. I meant really while we went were. and killed things, we kept they the would guards. Just, they would still follow. We could still use them to block, is what I'm trying to say. <laughs> body block we use them to body block the stupid slave so anyway so for, as far as the strategy goes i need you two on the back line so that you're more than two spaces away from the guards more than two spaces away because right, i'm planning to go here and here and if it's something that they attack two spaces the elite will follow me if it's a range attack on the first turn um the plan is to hopefully that they're staying in place or something otherwise i will only be able to open the door and then come back through. So, 
okay. basically it's it's gonna we have to see what what they're doing before i can figure out what to do but <clears throat> sure i can try staying here so I, again i'm gonna go you should go i don't know mid or maybe early mid um, i'm gonna go relatively fast but not as fast as i can to at least spring open that second door so that you have some targets to attack well we had plenty of targets last time yes right let's go with you and Oh shit! First turn. There we go. Let's go with you. And you. And I've already made myself a move order of what I need to do. Shuffle up that deck real quick. <laughs> also, Cal, remember, ask for fire when you need it. Yeah. Oh, my music stopped. What? I Music's know going for me. Um, I mean, if you if you give me fire first turn, I can poison and I wound the guy. I could like poison and wound the uh, elite. Wouldn't be a terrible idea, I guess. I suppose yeah. Then he's ticking down. I was planning to stun and wound one of them. So whichever one you don't do, I probably go have you go after the non-elite. Okay. Yeah, because they're. Do I, do I have any top? Less retaliate. Element generators that aren't burns. Uh. The I invisible. See see if the invisible. What if I brought that along, guys? Heal. The crystal. What if I just? Blast. What if I just no, made the slave invisible. invisible? When he oh. gets into a bad position. That That'd be a good interesting. Card. That'd be a good card I, to bring. I've, I've used it several times. Yep. Well, it was also very useful with the night. Mm -hmm. That's a clear interesting idea. Yeah. If he's in a spot that would be, hey, probably don't want him yeah. to die. Especially if you go fast, because he always goes, well. Mm. He's always 99. He's, he's always 99. But that means it's always going to burn off on the turn that you place it. Well, in that yeah. field part last time, he would have gone through the door and not been attacked at all. So yeah, I would need to go he goes fast. The, as soon as he goes through the door, it comes off. Because he's last. Ah, uh, yeah, yes, his, yep. it's the end that's of right. his as soon next as turn, he, right? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. That's that's the problem with it. Invisibility is great when you do it on yourself. Yeah. It doesn't last qu quite long enough on others to make it like, uh, oh yes, that's great. I mean, it's not great, but I mean, we can at we least can use it. Yeah. Like, oh, he's going to get hit, but I'm going before the things that are going to hit him. Yeah, but that means you've also played the card. If you know what they're doing. True. So it doesn't really help then. Yeah, that's that's the hardest part is knowing yeah. when is the right time to play it. Because you you could be like, okay, he's only gonna hit this time, play it, and they all went on defensive. Well, mm -hmm. okay. Well, if it doesn't, if you have some other top that isn't as great, it could be useful, maybe. Yeah. That I'm not saying it's a bad card. It's just it's it's just hard to know when a great time to use it as a defensive thing is. Yep. Yeah. That, that's the hardest part with defense in this game is with with choosing actions before you know what the others are doing, your defense can mean nothing. While an attack is always an attack. Mm -hmm. So. Boiling Arc was one, and okay, so I just didn't take any of them. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds about right. Well, granted, these two were like semi melee spells, so that's a little iffy for me, but. Well, boil Boiling Art comes up at the same time as the Ice one. Yeah. So they, they both generate an element on top. Mm hmm. Um, Gravel Vortex sucks. Yeah, all adjacent enemies. Yeah. It gives me Brilliant leaf, Flash but... would be. could be decent. To heal? Yeah. Yeah. That's what I was thinking. And it gives you an element to deal with, uh, do stuff with the next time. And it's a sun for Aaron. Mm -hmm. If for some reason he doesn't have it up, or you can burn it and use it, I'm, use I, it as a bottom. Once again, I'm not going to be attacking a whole lot. So. Aaron does have trouble keeping it up. <laughs> <laughs> ba -da -bum -ba -da -bum. Wow. Wow. Just okay. Um, still deciding on his deck. Yep. 
My dick! Uh, given how fast the last one went, probably best to plan on as much as we can. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> I mean, I, I, I could... I, I've, I've I introduced could a new try curve, going so. fast Which and, like, hitting hard. So, like, I might burn out an exhaust quickly, but maybe that's what we need? To just, you know, kill things quickly? I mean, that means I eventually like, needs to die, so... The guards, well, everything doesn't the need to die, but... We have to keep up no, with the, the guy the, and keep him healed. The goal is kill all enemies. Oh, it is? I thought it was just yeah. kill the shaman. Well, nope, kill all enemies and protect the orchid. Yep. Oh, well, tits. Okay, then. <laughs> yeah. We still have to kill everything. Mm -hmm. The thing is, if we can get him to the back, then they all funnel in towards us and we can do something about that. Sure. Because once the shaman's dead, he should just stand still. Yes. He yeah. And we could, still. like, body block him. But hope by hopefully by delaying him in this first room... It'll give you guys enough time to at least clear somewhat of a path for us. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you're giving me fire. And yep, you're I'm going gonna... pretty quick. I'm going, I'm going pretty fast. Pretty fast. Pretty fast. As I do, okay. as the Doomstalker. Yeah, yeah. I'm going the same speed I do every start of a game. This is true. If the doppelganger was faster, I'd use him just because he's got 10 health. <laughs> you good? Be a nice little meat shield. Yep. Flip it. Probably. 13. 56. 23. Just a little and the guard is... Hey! They're doing what I want them to. Good. Well, is this exactly what they did last time? I don't yeah. know. Oh, no, they, they, did a, they did an attack last time, but didn't move. Because you moved up and were like, wait, no, I don't move but up. But that's exactly what yeah. I wanted them to do. So, good. At least this is just the shield one, unlike the, what is it, the imps? With their shield five yeah. bullshit? Alright, so I'm going to start off by exposing. So they don't can expose yourself. Ha ha ha. It gives me two XP, though. <laughs> of course it does. <laughs> uh, no longer, enemies can no longer go invisible. And I gain advantage on doom targets. Or one target around. Um, and then I'm going to doom the elite. All you have right. my token? Yep. And then I am going to... Let's go with... Oh, that's right. These guards don't actually have shield. They just have retaliate. That was the one little nicer thing about the... What was it? The guards in the music notes solo scenario? Was that... I think they went at 50, didn't they? Yeah, they were set at 50. Yeah, so that was nice. That actually let you no, play I, around yeah. them a little bit. Yeah, oh, the, go the faster bandits or you mean? And... Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, and then I'm using Ring of Brutality to play Fresh Kill, which is 2 plus 2 plus 2, so 6 base damage. Please don't kill and this guard right away. Extra target, that's what I wanted. Oh. Uh, so now I also well, hit I mean, if we kill them three. both. So that's going to be a base 4 on that one. Uh, so 7 damage, guard 6, and they don't have that shield yet. Correct. So going before them. Uh, yep. And then the other one, I hit for five damage. Okay. I mean, is it a bad thing if we kill them? Yes, because then I can't keep them in place and use them as a body block. Gives me anyway. two XP. So the guards go. They shield retaliate two. It's then my turn. I'm going to go one, two, three, open the door. And then we need... Elite golem. Elite golem and two regular archers. Uh, archers, you said. One, two, golems number five. What were the archers? One and four. <sighs> One I'm drinking and beer from four. Richmond, Indiana. Did, was there a reason that needed to be so specific? Yes. Oh, okay. Oh, damn. If I just said Richmond, it could be from where I am. Mm. I okay, uh, so the golem is immobilizing, which means I'm not going to be going further. I'm just gonna... Yeah, back it up. Back it up. Back, How much movement back, did you have? Five back movement? it up. I have six. It's a move six jump. Oh, you're using your jump. Um, yeah, if he wasn't immobilizing, jump. I would have gone and opened up the door. But if he immobilized me, I can't get back into position. So, Does I then... Does he move and immobilize, or...? Uh, he can't pull me through enemies. 
Well, I was wondering more so if he would focus you or not, but yeah. Uh, let's see, I would be, yeah, I'd be closest to him. If you're hitting the door. Yeah. I, 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 well, I, you'd go to the door and then come back, I think I, was the plan. Yeah, oops. The most I could reach is here. Oh, so you're saying you were going to aim for the door in the next turn. No, I was going to go to the door and backtrack. And then come back, okay. But I wouldn't, if he's immobile, if he's pulling me and immobilizing, I'll be here. But, actually, I'm still going to go quick enough. No, then the problem is that she's up close to the guards. That's the issue. That's right. So we'll but the just guards aren't doing anything this turn. Correct. They're going to be doing something next turn, but I'll be immobilized. Did you pull the shaman, not the archers? Yes. There you go. But you pulled out the archer minis. <laughs> More immobilized. So someone's getting immobilized. Yeah, okay, then I'm Aaron is him. getting immobilized. I will stay right here then. <laughs> Aaron is not moving anywhere for a while. Okay, mm -hmm. uh, and then I pop my shield, gives me experience, don't care. Um, I think that's it. Okay, I'll... What's your initiative, Kyle? My initiative is 56. 56, okay, then the stone golem's gonna go. Everyone will go. Before Kyle. I mean, you, you did tell me like go mid speed, so I went almost perfectly mid. Okay, the golem's gonna name? go here. Attack. Me. Four, four damage. Send my name. Well, send my well, name. That's gonna be the one, but uh, so three damage. I didn't pop my freaking ring. Hold on, where's my ring? Pop the ring. Ring haste. No. It's been so long. Uh, so what did I say? Four. Four, three. Two, one, nothing. Okay. I am immobilized. And can't pull me through him. And then the archers are going to go. They got a movement of three and a range of four. So, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Yes. Actually, yep. he would go first, mm -hmm. but... Okay, uh, so two attacks on me for two damage piece. For one and two, which is nothing and nothing. I'm double immobilized. You're, you're all the nothings. And all the immobilized. And then Kyle, your turn. Okay, I will use the fire and also generate it with my move. You did generate your fire, right? You did... Do oh, whatever. I never actually did, but yes. Okay. Just, <laughs> just let me tap the card. Tap the thing. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. Okay. That's already part of the plan. Yes. Yes. Like you said, it's been a while. We forget things. <laughs> okay. So I'm going to use that to. Someone had to do all their uh, house selling last week. <laughs> poison and wound. No, it wasn't last week. I was just gone all week. He was yeah, camping. I went to my parents' had cabin. To go camping all week. And then went and looked at an apartment in Minnesota so I could actually move. So I could be closer. So we could actually have in person. We could play double gloom havens. Because we have Ooh. two copies. Um, double yeah, the size so of every scenario. We're going to attack for an Earth. What are you attacking? Uh, the elite okay. guard. So that is. Three damage. It has one shield. Two damage. Okay. It is poisoned and wounded. All right. You guys better move quick then. What's that? I meant past them to start killing the ship behind them. Oh. I mean, I'm kind of range. Yeah. Did. Yeah. So that means kill everything behind. Them. Well, yes. Not not disagreeing with that. I'm just. Just saying. But my, do but my doom's on this guy. See so you then, Kyle. It actually worked out really well. Yes. Okay. So, that's, so then he moves up into idiot range. Yep. <laughs> Which I think might be the best description for it. <laughs> yeah. Actually, I moved to idiot range. Let's make him go there, just in case. Because they have multi-hit. They don't have multi-hit, but... I guess uh, let's see. Nurture. 
I guess I may want to move. Next target. Yeah, I'll move. How fast are you going? Very fast. Aaron. I'm going faster than the guards can. Basically, oh, okay. I'm just staying in place so you can be safe being next to them if you want. Mm-hmm. Guards don't have any multi-attack, so... They don't. That you're Archers aware do. of. Archers do. It's kind of annoying. Okay, I'm right. I gotta shuffle these guys. Ready to board up a lip? Yep, flip. flip it. Bring on the flip! Ten. Fourteen. Fifteen. Fifteen, so Pat's up first. Did you not draw the goal? Did you not draw any of them? I did not draw the goal. There we go. Okay, you got the rest or the archer? I did all of them. They oh, all have shuffles. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yep. okay. Yep. He uh, drew it twice in a row. Gotcha. One in eight times it'll happen. Hey, it's Tom Golem trying to attack all of and enemies. One in eight times? It works every time. <clears throat> hmm. Kyle, how fast? You're going fast. Are you moving up, Kyle? E yes. Otherwise, I think that Golem's going to try and move in. He's only yeah. got two movement. He won't, he won't be able, able to in. make it, but he's going to slowly try and get in here. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, I see. Well, if, if you stand there, then they can't come in. Yep. And yeah, I was planning to move, so I had... Yeah, so I would All have right. enough range for my spells. So I am going to discard Magic. the uh, d Doom to place the Detonation Doom Plus t -t 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 on Archer number one. Okay. And then I will attack Today, for Junior. five base damage. Is there anything else? Let's see. How, what, what's that Archer Question at? Health? Mark. He's got 10. Archer 1, 10. Five base health. Could hit the times 2. Or I could boost it. Well, I can't boost it. Never mind. Anyways. Uh, so, yeah. Five damage against him. Let's see what I pull. Oh, I forgot I have advantage. Oops. Bum, bum, ba -dum. Well, wow. there's the miss. But I still do six damage. All right, he's down four. That's the end of my turn. Okay. It's Kyle's Captain got... Fisher Mafia will explode. All right, I'm going to pop this for Which light. One? Uh, one? one. Cool. And I can't move, so stay that in That is the plan. Since I got perfect okay. element draws. That's all. That's all I'm going to do. I guess a perfect element draw. You're up, Kyle. Okay, I'm going to step... One space there with my move two, generate dark and light. Um, then I will target Archer one and Stone Golem Stone five Golem. for five base damage. Using up the earth and fire to do five base damage. Okay. Which one are you and attacking first? Get the Archer. Okay. For seven damage. That kills him. Okay. It does what, three damage each? I believe that's it. Pat? What? Three damage? Yes, three damage to Archer the 4 explosion. and Golem 5. Okay. And then it's five da damage to the Golem. That five damage to Golem. Wind. Uh, he has three shields, so two gets by. He's down to 14. Passage with the damn shields. Okay, that's... Oh, yeah. I keep forgetting I'm not level 9 and I need to actually track experience. <laughs> so, last time I was 1, so... Just 2 total. Okay. 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 Uh, the archer's doing the same thing. He's attacking me for 2 damage. It just gets negated, but I am immobilized again. Then the guard goes. This one takes a tick. And then they both attack me for... Well, the elite attacks me for 6. Oh, that's what I should have done. Damn it. I could have done Six. plus one damage to both of those. Uh, minus two. Burn the sun and then generate it. Three, so I mm. take one damage. And then I do a damage back. Or is it two damage back? I think it's just retaliate one, right? Yeah. Retaliate one, so he takes a tick. This one's going to attack me for four. Three, zero. And then he takes a tick. And then the golem. Doesn't have a valid path to move, so he stays put. Why do you have a pencil? Nope, that's not what I wanted. <laughs> My bad. I wanted the line. There we go, I got the line. <laughs> We're good now. And I can aim at any part. End of round. Hail, wannabe. Try, trying to hit you, he can't hit you. 
Well, more can I hit him, but... You can't hit him either. Nope. Oh. Yeah. This I see. Okay, uh, that is Which the end of the round. He either needs to move... They have four range on that? Yeah. Okay. Well, well, I guess I can just focus the golem for now. Apparently the little guy should have gone over there. Because he would be much better over there. Yes. Because right now if that archer does multi-target, he's going to target the minion. Yep. Yes. We failed. Aaron failed. We lose. Good, good day, day sir. sir. Always good day, sir. I said... Good day. Good day, mate. Sound like you said goddamn night. No, well, I'm gonna attack and wound Not even close. guard. Sorry to disappoint you. Yeah, attack a guard, but that's how I let him free! Yeah. Stun and wound the other one. Well, you guys could move up, you know. Well, I, then I can't attack. I, I am moved up. What are you talking about? I meant pass them and get into the next room. Oh. But I, I can hit them from here. That would also make me a priority target. You can use that light if you want, by the way. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Look at all those elements. I'm, I'm looking at them. That's why it's taking me a little bit to decide what to do. Hmm. That might See, just the be... dark card works well with the vengeance card, but you don't have vengeance. What, what vengeance? This card. Oh. Yeah. Because you can do either one of the bonuses with it. Yeah. I mean, I wouldn't have used the bottom on vengeance. Yeah, you, you don't use the bottom, yeah, you use the top, but... yeah. Which I guess nice. would work well with that light and dark move. Yeah. This is my first time playing this class, so... Mm -hmm. Obviously I'm going to make failures. All the fails. Okay. Uh, hello, Hotfix. Broadcast, Hotfix. Fix Griffin Thank issue. You. Restart go, Steam go to get away. updates. Go away, thank you. <laughs> it is gone now. Hmm... TTS, yeah. What is current health? So that's that. That's that. And you're that. Okay. My other concern is that I just step into the room and then instantly die. Which is a possibility. Such, such things don't happen. No, never. Bring that, and so we're going to do that. I'm going to do slow. Good. Yep. Flip it. 18. 94. 94. That is pretty slow. What you oh, got? my other option was to go 17. Uh, 9. 9. You go first. Of course I do. What do you expect? I'm going to Doom the Golem. Doom the Golem. He suffers 2 damage at the start of each of his turns. Good, because yep. he's going to do 2 damage to himself as well. And then I'm going to attack him for 3 damage. 1, 2, 3, four. Wow. Nice. It's doomed, so... Ooh, add target. I will also add... Well, Pro. I can't hit the guy in the back, so I will add the non-elite. Oh. Which might kill him. Uh oh I could... It might, I might kill either one of them, but... Yeah, I mean, they have the same health. All right. In fact, the elite one has poison, so it's more likely to kill him. Well, if you so, do end up killing one, I'm going to charge the next door, so... Yep. Okay. Um, and then, so let's start off with the golem. Okay. He's do. Oh wait, I already did the roll it. So he takes four damage and uh, wound also. Four damage and wound, so one damage and wound. Okay. And then the uh, regular guard takes three, four damage. Okay. And a wound. So he's down to two with a wound. Okay, so he won't die on his turn. That's good. Just don't do any more damage to him. Well, I'm, I'm done attacking. Yeah. So, 
Uh, I, next... hadn't, I hadn't planned to pull the ad target. Yeah. <laughs> sure you did. Uh, the archer is just... Archer now has range 3, so he actually has to move up. Yay! And he's going to attack me for 2 damage. Yay! I don't think they pulled anything yet. Yay! Uh, two, Yay. so four damage. Correct, Yay. correct reactions to Aaron getting attacked. Uh, two, <laughs> three, and I'll take Girl another hit. Come on. Um, let's see, my 18 I think is next. Okay. So I can't move, but I will use that to get a bless in my deck. And put a shield up, and then... I was going to attack and stun him, but I think... I think I'm just gonna do no I don't no I don't want to melee these guys they're gonna retaliate so we'll just call it good all right next yeah. is the guards this guard takes a tick this guard takes a tick the elite hits me for five damage six damage minus two three four five six the other one hits me for three miss okay then the golem goes the golem takes essentially five damage on his turn so i'll just make him do five. that oh because two, two three four five i forgot about his two and he does seven damage yep. six damage minus two three four so two damage so if we ignore him for two more turns he will be dead uh-huh Okay. Wound is nice. Okay, and then Kyle, you're up. All right. Wound um, doom. What's that? I said wound and doom. Oh, wound and doom. Yep. <clears throat> so I'm going to use the dark and sun to do plus three damage to attack five the archer. Cool. I think is the right choice. It'd be that or yeah. multi-target, which I could attack the golem, but it's but you're not base do two. Yeah. So unless I get a plus, I'm not doing yeah. any damage to him, anyways. Get, get but it does give me extra and... draw, and I could get more elements, which might be more important than doing plus three damage to the archer. It's your call, man. Especially since even if Guard 3 dies next turn, if Aaron moves up, he then also has the... He's still blocked by it, but the Archer will eventually move back. True. Unless you disarm him. Or <laughs> mobilize him. Okay, I'm actually going to do the two targets. Okay. Okay. You know what? I'll use my power potion just to make it more likely I do uh, some damage to the both of them. To the uh, well, to the golem. The archer doesn't have shield, does it? No, but you need to actually kill it. Um, well, eventually I'll get to it. Because doing think two about damage it. to the golem means nothing right now. Because he takes three damage a turn. Quiet, you. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, so the golem. It's times six two. Damage. That's six damage. So he takes four damage, three damage. Hey, he's dead on his next turn. He will die on his next turn. The guard will die on his next turn. We just need to kill the archer and the other guard then. And that's three damage to the archer. Three damage to the archer. Okay. And that generate wind. Okay. I yes. also have a move that I can use to generate ice. Okay. I don't think I want to move forward. <laughs> you sure? It doesn't, it doesn't look like a great to generate spot. the ice, though. I know. Well, or the golem's gonna die, die the guard's gonna yeah, die. Yeah, yeah. But move zero is a valid move, so... It is. But you could stand in the doorway. But standing in the doorway doesn't do any good. Other than making me the target of the archer. Actually, I'm gonna go late, I think. Make sure that Which, the guard... I mean, if you I'm going need, late. If you need that... If you need this turn to not get hit by the archer, I can do that. No. In case he immobilizes or something. And you're going late. Okay. That might be better then. Okay. Assuming everything doesn't hit me this turn. Especially but if I really you're going late. You What's that? I really don't want you there. Then I won't go there. Thank you. Okay. 
Great talk. <laughs> cool story, bro. <laughs> shuffles. There's definitely some shuffles in this. That. That. I'd do that if there wasn't a stupid ass burn. Those ass burns. I'll be back. Gotta hate them. Mm, ass burn. Maybe not. Oh, wait. It's when you eat too much spicy food. Yep. Flip it. 45. 61. Damn it, Golem. I'm going late with a 55. God damn it, Golem. What's wrong with the Golem? I wanted the Golem to go faster because I wanted to take its spot. Oh. Ah, uh, so the guards go first. The normal one dies. The elite one takes the damage and then retaliates. Um, looks like the archer goes next. He just attacks for three damage to me. Oh, he puts up his retaliate. Uh, actually, like, hold he on. takes the damage and retaliates. How does he manage that? Nope. Uh, sorry, he attacks Kyle because Kyle's um, faster. He does four damage to Kyle. Ow. Uh, what is your initiative, Pat? 61, so then Kyle, you're up next. Yeah, I'm going back after both of you. Aaron, where do you plan on going? Um, yeah. Good question. If you can kill the archer, I'm gonna head towards the exit. I'm going after you, so... I'm just talking yes. to Kyle. If Kyle kills the archer, because oh. then the path is Kyle, open. kill the archer. Okay, kill the archer. Not, don't focus the guard. I will no, attack the guard archer. before moving if I need to. But uh, okay. Although she's just gonna run right by him, so or he's gonna run right by him. That's right. It's not hail. <laughs> I'm just so traumatized by the hail. You you did that every single time the first time we played this. Yep. I'll be back one second. Um. So you want him, the archer dead, so I can base. Because Golem's dead, yeah? Okay, everyone's gone. So I'll check myself. Yes, Golem is dead. Solo stream time. So I'm going to attack four, range four, the archer. So, what do we get? Oops, wait, forgot. I was supposed to shuffle because I had the times two last time. Let's try that again. Oh, good to know. Well, that worked well. You didn't kill the archer. Yeah, I noticed that. Thanks. Good one, Jab. Yeah, well, you know. <laughs> I'll move four. That would have worked if you had gone faster than the archer. What would have worked? Going there, because then he would have backed off and moved out of the way. Yeah, well... Not my fault. I pulled the null. I have a goddamn 30 card deck and I pulled the null. You didn't kill the archer. God damn I no. didn't do any damage. Hey, y'all the ones who decided to go slow, which you called 55 mm. slow. For me, not it is. Average. Right no, call it average. Okay. I played my slowest card. Okay. Well, the numbers can be between 1 and 99. So 55 is slow, rather than, you know, average. Well... You disappoint me. She's gonna go one, two, three, four and get around him. Best I can do is this, I no, guess. No, stop it. Well... <laughs> what, what are you doing? What are you planning to do now? Look at the card. Well, you had it blocked. No, that was the card on top. I'm going to immobilize her. Oh. So don't go there. Okay, cool. Well, then I'm going to go get a coin. I, I still can't play as a trap if I don't go there. Like I said, I wanted the golem to be dead. I was going to go there and place it in the doorway. But the golem isn't going to be dead. How about, how about this? Turn. I'm going to attack the guard. Okay, that works. Attack the guard. I, if I kill the guard. <laughs> hey, that would work. Four damage. Nope, of course. And then I take what? Three retaliate? Yeah, shit. Mm. 
Hey, look, you also uh, pulled nope. your now. Try, try five, retaliate. Oh, motherfucker. All right, uh, that sucked. All right, well. Um, <laughs> that was a good turn. Well, all you need I'm to do is pull anything other than the null. I am going to use a minor stamina potion to get a couple cards back. Specifically, my move jump. I have a feeling that's going to be useful coming up. And then I'll pop this thing to heal three self and get back my shields. Wasted the boots, but... Uh, and then... <sighs> Wait a minute. If I go here, you can move here and put it here. Or is that... I can't put it on a coin. Uh, Coin's not... Coin's is an occupied space. Why did you have to kill the guard? I, because I pulled the same as you not killing the guard. I pulled the card that made it happen. Yes. Yeah. Anyway, uh, let's see. So let's mine your what sixty sums here next. Yeah, I'm next. Why did the golem have to pull a frippin' ninety? <laughs> right. You pulled it. Pulled. Yeah. Well. Uh, then I will place a trap. But is anything actually going to step into the trap? There's no other way for her to go? Yes. Which is She true. will step into the trap. And be immobilized. Yep. Oh, it's an immobilized trap. Okay. It's a two damage immobilized, to be specific. Yeah, she'll take two damage in the process, but she'll, that means she also won't move next turn. Okay. Uh, hold on. Uh, so uh, you're done? Yep. Okay. Uh, the golem dies. Put a and coin. I'm going to also use. Okay, and then she goes. One, two. Oh, takes two damage, damage. And can't move next turn. That one. Pull. That's the new card that you said you took? Yeah, that's the card I grabbed for this. Normally, is a, uh, normally an immobilized trap, not too useful. But. What? When I'm using it against allies, because I know where they're trying to go and trying to keep them from going there. Can we get uh, Cthulhu, but with a mobilize or something? <clears throat> That'd be kind of cool. Then you could actually build, like, a group around it or something. Like, I'm the Doomstalker. I'm Angry Face. I don't need the... Alright, well this turn I'm handing out heals. Because those are the two cards I have. I could use some. So, one heal will go to the slave just to get her topped up. Okay, let's see here. And I can either heal Aaron or me. Oh, the golem died? Okay. Yep, golem died. Golem had to die. Yep. Unless you removed your doom. Which technically you could do. I could have. But why would I well, not? It doesn't really do us any good if the slave's already mobilized. Okay, we're gonna do this. Okay. I'm gonna start moving towards the next place. I'm gonna open the next door. Going fairly quickly, and I'll be jumping over you're opening, into You're opening the door, right? Yeah. So you just said. Yep. Uh, how fast are you opening this door? Pretty quick. Are you moving past the door? I can, yes. Okay. I'm healing. Then I have a plan. Yeah, I plan to get in and hopefully melee something. Is the is the plan? Mm, I guess I should probably wait for the next turn to do that. Then let's go with. Well, so far I think we're doing pretty well because I'm pretty sure the slave was down to single digits like after the first room. Um, Choose... are you planning on hitting this guard before you leave? Uh, okay. If you run and I run, she's gonna get hit by him. Maybe. Yes. Or he or whoever it is. I'm not Why the only one. She is. It is a he. If he's I just shielding and retaliating. Ah, uh, yeah. We should probably hit him before we go. Okay. Yeah. Fine. I'll hit him. Suffer more retaliate, but I'll hit him. I mean, if you can do. Well, actually, I got it. You got three it. Or four oh, damage. Yeah, I got it. He dies. Like he's got poison and wound. 
Actually, two damage. If you do two damage... Oh, he's the, dead. Okay. The poison will bump that up to three, and then the wound will kill him. 41. 23. All right. Uh, Archer's going to go first. Going... Right, 14. Yeah. He is attacking Kyle. And then placing a trap there. And then placing a trap. So he's attacking Kyle for two damage. If we want, he could go here and place a trap here. Three damage. Actually, no. This this works. Never mind. I mean, it kind of depends on if the archer dies. Otherwise, the slave will run through the second trap as well. Yeah, but they won't do that till the next turn. True. End of the next turn, so... We have but a I'm not attacking the archer effect. this turn. So. Well, we don't have to kill the archer this turn. Can we kill the archer next turn? Kyle, you took mm. three damage. I got a short rest. Three damage? Yep. Do I look like I'm made of health? Right to the face. Uh, Pat, what's your second card? Fucking... My attack that mm. I might kill him with. You get to go first, then. Why don't you ever... Okay. I'm going to go... There you go. And I go invisible. So that's cool. what I do. And then I will attack the guard for four damage. Oh. And five damage plus wound. Alright, he's dead. Oh, I fully killed him. Sad. Yep. No uh, extra effect. Be that way. You poor thing. Um, yes. All good. You good? Yep. Okay. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. I reveal the room. And we got ourselves a... That's a shaman. And two regular archers, a regular golem, and an elite golem. Don't worry, guys. We're almost halfway. Two... Well, maybe these first three rooms are the really difficult ones. That's how it usually goes. All right, so the golems are just retaliating. The shamans are just moving and healing. The archer is going to do what the archer does. Those are not archers, Pat. Those are guards. Those These are, are all archers. archers. Archer, I'm talking archer, the scenario shaman. book. Those are guards. I can't see. Yes, those are guards. Those are not archers. What? No, those are both archers. Yes, know, we they're pulled supposed archer, to be guards. They're supposed to be oh. guards. It was well, sorry, some before. of us don't have the damn book. That's why we were saying that. It, it, yeah, but Aaron wasn't saying it in the right way. Yeah. He was saying those are guards. And it's like, no, those are clearly archers on the field. <laughs> what are you supposed to say is those are supposed to be guards. Those are, didn't I say that? You said those are guards, not those are you supposed to be guards. You said those are guards. Oh. Meaning, like, active. They're actively guards. You know, makes it sound like the game's glitching out or something. Oh, yeah, I forgot about those traps. We never even got to those. Correct. Nope. Straight up damage traps. Don't worry, there's two more somewhere in the scenario. Did anyone buy the... Hmm, I wonder where. <laughs> Seems like a possibility. Did anyone buy the spider? <laughs> Go to Sarm. Um, so the guards are going to move in all attack. traps in the one radius or whatever. Mm -hmm. Ah, shit. What's the shaman number? Aaron can face tank it. I'm going to have to. I mean, yeah, he can. Or I can. I haven't taken any hits. I've got a fair How amount of they? points. On uh, this level, they are six. Hmm. I mean, we only have to hit one to open up the path for her. Yep. Um, I'm burning the light, generating yeah. light for yeah. six damage. Hey, bless! I one-shot the shaman. Nice. Nuke that fucker! Good. That's a good thing to get out of the way. Yeah. Now to the shaman the with the... Like, disarms and heals and everything that sucks. Yeah. Uh, and then I use my boots for that. Okay. Was that the shaman? Will, will the will the slave just then still now? That's not the shaman, no. That, that I, not the shaman. I know. Uh, next up, the dream. stone golems do the retaliate thing. The shaman is dead. And then we're back in normal order. So, Kyle, you're 41, right? Yes. So, you're 41's next. Yeah, okay. it's the only one 
Oh, I guess the guard still has No, the guard is... No, there's new guards. Blah, 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 the guard is dead. Wait, no, there's more cars. There's, there's things and stuffs. Okay, so I'm going to heal the slave. Back to full. Woo! Um, so I can either heal you. You're at 20. I am down to 5. I'm also going to take a few hits right here. But in theory, I shouldn't get hit much. Even though I've gotten hit twice so far, which is enough. So I'm going to heal you for three. Okay. Sweet. And I generated all the goddamn sun in the world. Okay. All of it? You, you brought the sun down to the world? Seems yes. dangerous. All right. So the guard's going to attack me for three damage apiece. So One nothing. And, and five. five. So two... Three, four, five. Guess I'm losing that one. And there we go. And then she loses her immobilize. He moves. Blah, whatever. He. It's, <laughs> it's not he. hail. <laughs> it's not. It's not hail. God damn it. Why are you so sexist against the NPCs? <laughs> Kyle, are you able to attack the archer? Sure. I gotta be able to kill the archer. Maybe. <laughs> okay. Um, I can try to kill the archer. I'm trying to think hopefully, of how I want to do this. Hopefully, that's good enough for you. I'm trying to figure out how I want to... I'll go like this. And then if you're successful, I don't have to worry about it. Though even if we don't kill the archer, it will. if it attacks, it will move out of the way of... Uh, it. You almost said hail! What is wrong with you people? <laughs> <laughs> We're still traumatized. Hail is very abusive. I don't know. The hail missions weren't that bad. But it's usually hail that we're protecting. The first time we did it, we had a crag heart. The second time, we used a beast tyrant. Yeah. <laughs> it was easy. 28. 61. 18. Oh, fuck. All right. Before the archer. That's really all I need. All right, I get hit by oh, the guard quick. Golems are hurting themselves. Uh, yeah. For four damage, so two, three... And then... Well, at least you're immune to poison. Two, three... Okay. Saves you one damage. Yeah, but that means what I was planning to do with my shield kind of blows. Um, well, you still got golems. Let's see, they're range three, so I can move out of them at least. This one. Yeah, this one will be hitting you if you don't move. I don't really want to uh, attack these guys. I'm going to move... One, two, three... Then I'm going to be in range of the other one. Uh, one, two, three. I mean, do you slug the golems if you have an attack? A uh, base to attack, which means oh, okay. one pierce the shield. Um, I haven't decided where I'm going to go, but I'm getting a bless I mean, to myself. The guards only have a retaliative one. Oh, that's true. Um, They're not elites, so they do have a shield of one. But Nah, I think I'll just heal myself. Yeah. Uh, I guess you have the top heal, might as well. Yep. And next up is. Then I could have healed myself last tile. All right. So let's see if I can do anything useful. I'm going to attack to the archer. Add a target. Okay. Added target, which there are none. That's not even a rolling add target. It's just an add. Okay. So you hit him for two damage. The elementalist doesn't really get rolls. Okay, so he's down to two health. In fact, the elementalist gets zero rolls. <laughs> and okay, then I'm going to attack three. The archer then. And generate some wind. All right. Three Archer's damage and generate wind. dead. All righty. There you go. I killed it. Uh, next, while well, the archers are done, and then it's Pat. Me! 
I will go one, two, three, four. That's going right here. And I will make another trap. Nice. <laughs> Oh, yeah, you just have the ability to kind of get those things forever, that's right. Cool. That's why I said, basically I'm going to do this at every door we go through, so... Okay, mm -hmm. and then the golems take two damage, nothing's in range three, so... That's the round. Hail moves up, not hail, fuck, one, two, three, four. Why should you have to move four? Move three. Okay. <laughs> And then I rest. Did you give her boots of speed or something? What's going on here? Boots of dashing. Yeah. Can you give the slave your defensive stance? Defensive stance. So uh, they move slower. If the saw What's... does that, I think. Have a shield. You can give a shield, What's... but they don't have a player area, so you can't do that. What's the um? Well, I would need to, we would need to see what the card actually says. Um. What is what? What? What's your boost? card, Kyle. Your stay and play boost card. There's two of them. One's uh, gain an element, but lose range. What's and the other one's just burn range to gain attack? I have burn an element to add an attack. Okay, that's just that's just the card. Okay. I was trying to think if there's a negative to it. I Not that one, no. That it stays in. So, next round, right? The yep. other one is I generate an element each turn and I lose one attack from all my attacks. Well, I am going to actually short rest. Which I sometimes think, think would actually be worth it. Just to always have an element. Yeah, but your, a lot of your ranges are so slow. Or so low. That low damage, yeah. More range. Or low damage, yeah. Because you lose attack power. Mm -hmm. So what good is gaining your element if you then use it to just basically gain that back? Sure, but if it gives me, like, plus three, maybe. But, it, but the problem is, you only have ten cards, so are you really going to use a card to sit out the entire time, be short a yeah, card the entire time? That, that's why I've never put in the other one. Yeah. Because I'm always so low on cards. If, if, oh, I, no. want to, if I want to lose cards, I can do that. I just exhaust myself. I'm not going to lose my, my special card. Your trap? Yeah. Oh no, my big one. Uh, <laughs> I'll just cut out some damage. Um, okay, so... Man, I have the perfect elements for want, Chain Lightning. What do you want me to focus on, Aaron? Um, probably the guard, since they retaliate. Guards, cool. got it. Although the golems hit... Ah, they only retaliate one, never mind. Probably do the golems, because they hit harder. Okay. Which one has... The elite does have a bigger shield. Slightly bigger shield, yeah. Let's go with... I don't know. This one, two... Actually, yeah. Next turn, I could run up and... Oops. 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 God damn it. Oops, oops, oops. Also, oops. And oops. I'm ready. Oh, oh, wait Kyle still needs a card. Kyle does need a card. There you go. And flip it. 18. 33. 36. Hey, the golems are going fast. And the guards are going really it. late. <laughs> and the golems got three movement. God uh, damn it. Uh-huh, but I get to go first so I can intercept them. Well, you guys just never go at the, at the speed you want, huh, Pat? One what day. Did you say, One day they'll go at the speed you want. You can move it, make him move so he's not next to me anyways. Oh, yeah, I see what you mean. Uh, what are the guards doing? Guards are moving two spaces, so... Um... Can the other goal and reach mean... me if I'm here? One, two, three? Yes. They'll have three movement. Mm. That's what I'm saying. You can literally stay right where you're standing. I will just stay where I am. I'm going to pop my wings. Try to clear the room. Okay. And then what? That's it. Oh. 
Can you give me a bless? No. How am I supposed to do any damage? Jeez. What a jealous lover. <laughs> so now the golems go... Selfish. Selfish lover. lover. There we go. Words. Three movements, so one, two, three. You want him there, right? Not the other one? Yeah, because he's your, your, yeah, your, he's focusing you. Okay. Nope, yep, that's perfect. That's the way I want them. <laughs> uh, so the non-elite's going to hit me first four. I should really check this. Nope, okay. Uh, so three damage, two, three. So nothing. Doesn't even touch your armor. I kind of want it to, but... Uh, next up is Pat with your 33. Yep. So I am going to Doom the non-elite. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You Doom? That I know, it's crazy, right? right? Uh, and then I am going to use the fresh kill on... You haven't hit them yet, have you? Oh, God damn it! you did. No, I didn't hit, didn't them. hit them. They've done damage to themselves. Oh, they did damage to themselves. God damn it. I'll play the other one then. Okay, so I only get to do two damage. Uh... I thought you were focusing on the guards. They did damage themselves. No, the the he told me to go after the uh, golems because the, these guys only retaliate for one. Oh. Um, yeah. So uh, one damage you can't four prevent. Four damage versus him, with only twice. He is stunned. Okay. It takes four damage. Four damage, so two with the shield. All right. And then I will... I will not do that. Okay. And then I'm done. Okay. Kyle, you're up. All right. I'm going to Curse Blast. Yay. All of them. And I'm going to... Use the sun. No, don't use the sun. I need the sun. Use the wind. <laughs> <laughs> well, what do you mean? It's going away. You already went this turn. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Use, use whatever you I want. Mean, They're both going away. It also literally doesn't matter which one I use. <laughs> I just said one to say one. To use my robes of invocation. Nice. All right, then. And to... a power potion and my spell and... I use the power potion. I know. Um, so that's two attack to everything. Yep. So uh, just start on the targets. Start with the golems. With the elite. Uh, three damage. So nothing. nothing. Okay. Next one. Yep. He's fire. So two damage. Nothing. Okay. nothing. Next one. Ice. And two damage. Two damage. Yes. Okay. So ten on that one. And then four on the last one. All right. Ooh. Nice job. And then I actually did damage to one thing. Two, and four curses. three, four. Shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. Okay. And then so let's see. I could shield. But that doesn't. That only gives me one more element. And not one I really move. need. Or so I will instead move, move two. Move two, stand on the trap. And make hover over the trap and make her take one extra turn. Yes. Nice. That is a much better use. I agree. All right. Next up, guards. Oh, huh, yeah, that's clever. Uh, guards get two movement, so this one's going to attack in place and one's going to move up. What would happen? I don't know. <laughs> I was just thinking that. Because if I'm standing here, they can't occupy the space, but they get immobilized in my space. Can, Can they just not move. move then? Is she trapped there? Did we I just no figure out how, how to stop her? I have Does no she, idea how... Maybe she gets shunted? She might get shunted. Because she would try to move into the space, hit the trap. Four... And be forced. Two, three, four... She can't stop there, so she would have to... Either move she might actually direction. take like, trap Four, damage because you would be three. considered an obstacle in that case. And if you're forced into if if it's mm. that's the way I would say is that she would take trap damage because she can't occupy the same hex as another. Mm -hmm. And then get bumped. But this turn she can't occupy it. 
but correct. Yeah, she wouldn't go there no matter what. Yeah. Um, okay, and then she moves, and that's the end of the round. Joy. Well, now that I got advantage and a ton of damage. I do nothing. I sit here and pout. <laughs> right. Uh, I think we'll do... Well, I could use it before my turn and go one, two, three, four, five, six. Damn it. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ah, there we go. Okay, we'll do that. I was like, real quick. Anyways. Uh, Before. That, that would probably be one of those special case scenarios. Mm -hmm. Not common enough to be in the rule book. If you have flying, uh, you just occupy see, a trap I'll hex. And, if it mentioned and you have a mindless uh, slave that tries to move during a move if it, it's at the end's move, because I don't know if I've ever actually seen it written down. I mean, I guess it could really word, happen with but... anyone that tries to do it. It's not just unique to this scenario. Because Pat could try walking through me and well, hit the it trap. Work for me I'm, flying. I'm not talking about you with your boots. I'm just... I Same picked the yeah. closest person near me. Why must you fight me on everything? That's what I do. Anyways. Um, um, let's see. I guess it doesn't matter if I pick that one. But I could take those ones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna try that. Got it. Got it. Let's go. Good clip. We're going with the options. Fifteen. Thirty-one. Twenty-five. I'm the slowest one here. Guards are fifteen. Shield and attack poison. So... Fuck you, guards! I'm going before you. Yep. Lick my balls. I'm not, but I'm not doing anything with them anyways. Lick my balls. Generating me light? Question mark. Yes. Heart you. Um, so I'm going to use the multi-target with the ice and fire to attack both the guards. Okay. So that's two attack. Two damage. Okay. Nice. And two damage. Perfect. And win. Yes, I have light and darkness. Sweet. Where are you Imagine. moving? I'm gonna move here. Okay, I will be going up and studying the elite golem, so they won't do anything this turn. Yeah, I've already got the little one done. Okay, uh, so the guards do three attack to me, times two, so six. Awesome. Four gets by. And the other one is two damage, which gets blocked. Poison is ignored. And then it's my turn. I go one, two, no wait, hold on. I first pop my necklace ring, or the earring to get my items back. And then I use my boots to go Are one, you even two, three, four, five, six. Yep. Are you generating it back? Yep. Okay. Um, I'm gonna use my I... stamina potion. So this is attack four, plus three for this, so that's attack seven. Rolling heal. 14 damage to the did elite. You, did you let the guards attack you before you did all this? Yeah. Okay. The I don't one, remember them. The one drew times, times two. So just, ah, okay. Um, so I did 14 damage to the golem. So 11 got through, so he's down to three health. I healed myself for one, and the golem is wounded and stunned. Oh, well, next. 14 damage. Yeah, and that was advantage, so I had to pull both. Yep, good. Alrighty then. And that was I'm even a bless. And then I'm gonna pop a stamina potion. Okay, I'm boosting my all attacks against doomed enemies this round. And then I'm going to attack Skull Golem, Stone Golem 5. 4, okay. 3, plus 2. Plus three is eight damage. 
uh, advantage. So, 10 damage, plus a wound. 10 damage is enough. He's dead. Well, did. Okay. And then the golem goes, he is stunned, he takes a wound damage, and does nothing. And then the chick goes, and immobilizes herself. Himself. Next round. I am planning to use the sun this time. Okay. I mean, you can use it, it if you generate it. Does it give you more than two damage? Gives me three damage. Gives you three damage, okay. Um, I will go... At, or in another target. <laughs> if you count it as the other target, then technically it gives me five more damage. I'm going to try to do the biggest attack I got, which is... Probably you. And I, will I be used my stamina potion, so I got my big attack back. <laughs> kind and. I'm gonna attack the guard and then go run in the trap. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> are, you, are you attacking the healthy guard or the non healthy guard? The healthy guard. Are you plan on killing the healthy guard? Uh, let's I'm planning on attacking both play? guards. Um. With advantage, I should be able to kill it, yes. Unless I draw a lot of rolling okay. modifiers. Let me do this instead. And So what if I use the light? Oh wait, well, if you I use the light to kill the guard, then it's probably fine. I actually don't need to use the light. Never mind. I'll let I'll let you have it. That's uh, fine. I have enough damage okay. without it. If you kill one of the guards with the light? Sure. I should be fine with that. Um, and my extra target would just be the golem, and I... Flip it. Maybe do some damage to it. Nine. All right. Pat's up first. So I should I be able to kill... leave the golems for the big guard four, damage. Right? I'm dooming the golem. The golem will die on its turn. Okay. Bet. Okay. Golem is dead then. Okay. And then I am going to shoot the unhealthy guard. All right. Four base damage. Plus one, five damage. Does he have two or less health? He does indeed. He's dead. All right. There you go. So I don't need the sun. Okay, I will use it just in case then. I mean, unless you want me to attack Stone Golem 2, then I could do that and do extra damage that way, which might be better. As you said, you were getting two damage from it. I will be getting two, so I'll have a total of ten. So well, unless again, I draw... the golem is dead. Oh yeah, the golem's dead. Never mind. Yeah, just attack Use the guard. The I forgot that already. <laughs> I have a very short attention span. I guess. So who's first? Kyle's first. I was 17. Yeah. I'm first. Yeah, just, just... I will attack guard four with ice and wind. So five base damage? Five base damage. Fire, five damage. All right, he's down to three. Okay, um, uh, good. Then you I move. Hold on, yeah, let me try to see what they're doing. Stone Golem's dead. God's just attacking. And hopefully he'll be dead before that, so. Yep. True. Go grab that coin. Mm hmm. I'm gonna grab the coin. Uh, okay. For an additional reason. He, he believes in you, Aaron. Alright, I'm gonna use the light for seven, plus three is well, ten. I'm also kind of body blocking. We've got plus one it? and roll and heal. Good, because I need it. Oh no, I guess he can move right through me. Never mind. Oh, he's mobilized still. Never mind. Yeah, he's not moving this turn. He's dead. I forgot that I delayed him the turn before. And then I'm going to move two. Trigger the and trap. Six I'm damage. Six damage. Okay. I'm down to... Yeah, barely anything. You're 16. fine. 16. That gives me another bless. Okay. 
That's my turn. Then the guards go, but there's none left. And then the golem dies. <coughs> um, and Aaron, how fast are you moving? Speed-wise or initiative-wise? Initiative-wise. Fast, but not as fast. Uh, I guess I can go as fast as I can. If you go slow, I can heal you. Uh, how slow you talk? Don't go too slow. Because I need you off that spot. Actually, oh, you never gave the him damage. There yeah, we go. for stepping on a trap. Yep. So never mind, I'll heal him instead. Okay, I'll go super fast then and open the door. Sounds Since I'm point. the only one that cares enough to recognize his identity. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so... Flip it. Flip it. I'll try it in mine. That one. And flip it. 67. 61. 14. All, All right. right. All right. One. We need... Death. 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 Two, two arch or two guards, one archer. Oh wait, that's die. Fuck. One of the guards is elite. I messed it up. Help. Kyle, you oh. were wrong. I had the one guard. What? Here. Oh. By oh, the treasure. The treasure. Chest. Yep. Cool. Turns out the slave is really interested in gold. Goes for the treasure chest. <laughs> wow. Wow. Okay, uh, the archers are moving and attacking, and the guard also moving and attacking. So we got 12, oh, there's only 17. One archer, They've got move 3 and move 2, and then the archers are range 3 with only 2 move. Archers will go first, so he actually can't get by these guys, and goes 1, 2. Well, I guess I could go here. The who one... said the immobilized trap was not worth anything? The... I don't think anyone uh, said that. Well, that was only no, two. Like the forums. Oh. People will complain about it? No, they're just saying, like, why would you ever have this card in your deck? Oh. Well, that would prevent me from getting hit by the archer. I think I'll go here and shield retaliate. Obviously, they never plan to use it on allies. <laughs> yeah. It's, um, it's definitely more useful than most of the cards that are, like, melee range attack, immobilize. All right, so the archer's going to move up. One, two, three, four. That's as close as he can get, so that's all he will move. The elite's going to go one, two. The normal's going to go one, two. And he's going to I, attack I actually me. like the, uh, the base, three, the bottom of this card also. Two. Because it's immobilize and then move. It's like, fight, you're too close, get away. Yeah. Yeah, that was, that was something that pissed me off about Craig, was Craig had an, a, a move a immobilized. And then it's your uh, your turn. It's like, why? Right <laughs> You're stuck next to me. Other than ranged targets, <laughs> why? You can't get away. In uh, case you happen to run into a mob of archers. They already went. Yeah. So yes, everything went. So I will move five. One, two, five. I don't trigger it anyways. Mm hmm. And I'll throw this on the door. And that's it. <laughs> hmm. Okay, so I'm going to heal him. <laughs> and then I'm going to move the trap four. <laughs> Because he'll go, hit, 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 hit. Yep, exactly. It's actually very well spaced out for this strategy. Yes. What is, what is well spaced out? The, the size of the room oh. with his three movement. Because he'll go three, two. Because if he had two movement, he'll go two. That could be the same, but ah, right. how big it is, two would work. Yeah. Or it would actually try and, he would actually just try to jump past earlier mm -hmm. on caused the weird thing that we talked about. Oh, and then I had generated light last turn. <laughs> the weird explosion thing. Unless you yeah, used my light. No, okay. Um, so no, we'll I, do didn't. This. I didn't use any elements, unfortunately. I went through the effort of generating them and didn't use it. Um, I need a short rest. 
I do a long rest. Short rest would probably be more useful. Yeah, it's up to you. Do damage. I'll focus on that guard four. Okay, I'll the elite. Whack and and he stun does move fight. this turn. Yeah. So he's there. I just need to make sure I move next turn, not this turn. Do not so move this turn. I'm gonna try to one shot this guard in front of me too. But the only thing that really gets me is my robes back. Which is useful to plan on doing the crystal blast again. The last room, you mean? We haven't drawn a... Well, I guess they haven't attacked all that much, but we haven't drawn a single curse back out. Yeah, we've usually been stopping them from attacking. Which is good. We're fine with that. This is just backup. Mm -hmm. Curses are useful for when... Oh, come stop that attack. Hey, I stopped that attack. Prematurely. Mm -hmm. uh, just waiting on Cal. Yep. Okay, I'm going to long rest. I'll long rest, okay. Flip. Flip. 23. 70, 29, 25. You're up first. All right, I am going to go invisible and, and shoot. Well, I'm going to activate this first on the elite. Um, so I get plus two damage on Mr. Elite guy. Okay. And then I'm doing three base damage. So five plus advantage. So minus two or plus one. Let's go with the plus one. So six damage. Six damage. Okay. And I'm invisible and yeah. All right, uh, since I'm going to get immobilized, I'm going to move closer to the door. I will be consuming light, generating light, so that is four, seven damage, advantage, against the non-elite guard. Um, so rolling plus that, so that's eight damage. Tink. Stun and wound. And then I take one back. I got one more tick of that left. Okay, um, then it's the archer. The archer is going to attack me for two damage. There's a curse, but I am immobilized. And then the guard's gonna go. So the elite guard is already adjacent to me. He will attack me for six damage. Ow. Six, or uh, two, four, five, six. And then the non-elite one takes a wound and stun goes off. Okay. And then Kyle long rests. Yes. Yeah, it's quiet. And then I short rest. And he moves up. I brought that one back. So all I need to do is go faster than 100. <laughs> I assume when you are going to get the chest because I don't have my jump anymore and I don't want to take another trap damage yeah that's fine I'll get it Ready? Wait on Pat. A second. Yeah, I'm looking. That man whore. Alright. I'm ready. Yep. Flip it. 15. D3. Oh, you bitch. <laughs> Who? The, the guards. They're attacking and guarding. Yep. Oh, well, maybe they won't be alive. Alright, so I'm going to start off with an attack against the elite. I forgot to take the retaliate. Anyway. For 4 damage, plus 2. Take on health, 13. Yep. 6. Still higher than my max. <laughs> I get advantage on this. So plus 1 or plus 1. So 7 damage. To the elite, okay. Yep. Is he at 2 or less? He's at 4. So no. And then I move five. One, two, three, four, five. And then 
I pop my ring of haste and play Ooh, ring of haste. wild command. Move three, attack two, target one doomed enemy at any range. So I will move on to the chest, which gives it to me at the end of the round. Yep. And I attack the guard for two, plus two is four. I do not get advantage on the second attack, though. Minus one is three damage. Not dead. One short. What is in that chest, sir? In that chest, which is number 29, is... It's the nuke. We all lose. I gained some in, some endurance foot wraps. Ooh. I don't have a pen. What gives? How do I not have a pen on me? You know, if you want to buy pens in bulk, there's this great website you can go to called Pen Island. <laughs> endurance foot, foot reps. If you move four or more hexes on your turn, perform a heal one self act. No, thank you. I don't move a whole lot, actually. Wouldn't be bad it's for... Not bad for high mobility. Uh, okay. Uh, so, Kyle, you're up. I think there's one out there that actually does that before attack. If you can do one damage to each that of them... Sense. I can't. <laughs> okay. I can do damage to one, which will probably be the stronger one, yeah, being that it does more damage. That might not be a bad idea. So... Yeah, I'll uh, use the light, which I'm going to generate anyways. You need to get XP. Uh, yep. Plus one attack. So that's base three. Leaf. So that's three damage to guard five. Uh, elite guard. Blah, blah, blah. Whichever one it is. Whichever one. Huh? And then move to. Uh, yes. Okay. And all your elements return. Okay. And generate my elements. All right, now the normal guard is going to attack me for... Th well, he's going to take a damage. And he's going to attack for three. Oh, the lead is dead. This six, awesome. Two, three, so I take three. Um, yeah, great. Uh, I can't move, so... Do I want to waste an attack on him? No. Why can't you move? I'm immobilized. Oh, you got immobilized after your turn last time. Okay. Correct. I'm just going to shield then. I'm not going to bother wasting my attack because you're going to die. Mobilized Is it a waste away. of attack? Meaning I, I have one more tick of my Angelic Ascension. Oh, gotcha. So it would be a big massive overkill on him. You could probably save it for the next room or on this arch. Um, yeah, okay. probably have the next room would be The better. archer will attack me for four. Minus two, three, four. So zero damage. And then this chick moves, this dude moves up, takes two damage, and is mobilized. I'm gonna long rest. Welcome. You do that. Because I want to get my oh, shield back. Archer. Can't shoot you if you're there. Could shoot the guard, but he's gonna be dead anyways. Or can you? Nope. Or it's can this wall. You? Stinking wall. It smells. It does smell. Sounds it dead. Let's go with it. Smells like poopy. Yeah. Is it this maybe? I bet you haven't long rested, right? I have not long rested. Okay, so no more fire. Nope, still can't use the fire. Okay. I guess that doesn't really help anyways. I'll do that. I'll do, I'll do this. 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 Yeah, just in case I get more. Just in case. Maybe I'll go with this. this. I may be highly effective as a Doomstalker right now. Okay, flip it. You're long resting? Yep. 23. 23 goes first. Alright. 
So I'm going to move three and go invisible. One, two, three. And then I'm going to base attack. Nice. It's maybe the first time I have ever base attacked. This tile must be awkward or something. Cause and I miss. Well, yeah. I mean, if you're going to miss on anything. Miss on the one that is a very ineffective attack? Yeah. Kyle, the one that wasn't really going to do anything anyways. Okay. I am going to move two. Get that coin. And then I'm going to attack three. Attack five. The outro. Some elements. And are you going through the door, door in this next turn? One, two, three, four... Yes. Okay. For six damage. Six damage. Okay, he's down nice. to four. Are you making it all the way through the door on this next turn? I can make it to the door. You can make it inside the doorway? One, way? two, three. Oh, wait, I don't have jump. Three, four. I cannot make it to the door if the arch is alive. Oh, you burned your... Jump card. The jump is the Angelic Ascension. Yep. One, two. He's going to attack Kyle. Nice. All right. Uh, four damage to Kyle. Three damage to Kyle. Don't and like getting hit. Then the guard dies. And the Oops. slave loses immobilize. Okay. I long rest. I do not like being hit, no. Please, no more. Okay, well, I'm gonna go... I will One, two, try to kill the archer. Three, four, five, I will six, actually be killing the archer. Seven. Well, then maybe I won't bring the safety back up then. It is always possible I could miss, but... It is. Yeah, it'd be he nice also to have rocket health. boots. So we're going to use... So are we just planning to not open the door this turn, then? Then do it next turn? Correct. Okay. I will... Well, unless the archer's dead, right? That you said you could make it if the archer dies. I... You'd have to go a lot quicker than me, and then we would all be have done turns before them, so... Hmm... I mean, you're, the, you're tanky anyways. Yeah. And you just long rested. Yeah. Could mean you have a full arsenal or you walk in and just uber shield. I don't know what you're doing. I know what he's doing. What am I doing? Poorly. What? You're doing poorly. Oh, I'm doing poorly. Did you catch that? <laughs> Just wondering if there's anything I can do to help you guys out a little bit. Um, we'll do this, I guess. If I go there, one, two, three, four. That could work. Okay, we'll do that, I guess. Then I'll open the door next turn. Okay, flip. Seventeen. Thirty-one. Sixteen. You bastard. All right. Um, attacking Damn Kyle it. for two. One damage. And then it's Kyle's turn. Glad the snare is getting close to a close. <laughs> you got plenty of health. Yeah, I know, right? All right, uh, attacking, burning the fire for poison and wound. Space three. Not gonna heal yourself. Yeah. Meh. Yeah. Meh. Uh -huh. For four damage. Oh, that kills him. There you go. Yeah, I could have healed for three, but that's not much. Just a single attack. Aaron, please tell me you're getting past the tree stump. What if I don't get past the tree stump? You should really get past the tree stump. Why? Because <laughs> otherwise you'll run into a trap. Otherwise, I will run into a trap. 
He's going to place a trap here. The uh, mobilized trap. One, two, three, four. How's that? That's Not good enough. On, that's on the tree dump. Five, six, seven. And you don't have to go all the way to the door. Well, I'm, if I'm going to use my boots, I might as well. Huh? Ah, you're fine. I'll wait. Were you planning on <laughs> running further in the next room? So then, Kyle, take a bless, and then I'm going to okay. move. And then I'm up. Yep. So I really like that coin. Then I have to move more later, so... so here. <laughs> I'm just... I'll just be back here. Don't mind me. But you're technically making her take longer, so... I know. Tactical moving. These choices were made on purpose. Everybody went? Mm -hmm. One, two, three. Huzzah! Okay, I'm gonna go pretty quick. Hey Kyle, you don't have to stand on the trap this time. I saw that. Uh, I also need to short rest. That will be next turn. Oh, not my rain of arrows. I think I still, regardless, want to retire oh, the character anyways. I do that. There's two card swaps I want to make, but I can't do it, um, obviously. I have lost almost all my high level cards. All your yeah. high level damage cards, you mean? No, just all my high level cards. I have mostly just one level one cards left. All of those cards. That's the card I just keep There's only one room level. left. Sure, but we do kind of need our main damage dealer. I'm your main damage dealer. What are you talking about? The talking about the fucking single target nuke over there. Oh, don't worry about him. Fucking tactical cruise missile through a window. <laughs> Several hundred miles <laughs> through a window. You guys away. never heard that? That was that was one of the things that always floated That's around seven. like middle school and high school with the Gulf War or whatever. Oh, Aaron's not going fast enough for me to play Where it would be... Where they would, like, advertise that they could fly a cruise missile through a window from several hundred miles away using drones and laser targeting. Ah. Uh, should I just use this? I guess I'm, I'm not going as quick as I can, but pretty quick, so... Hmm. This is really too cool. Also reminds me of this one show where they're showing off uh, airburst weapons. And this was like a cannon. It was like a 30 millimeter cannon on top of a like personnel carrier. And the thing, its airburst timing was so accurate that they could explode like inside a cement wall. So rather than, you know, murdering everyone, including hostages inside, they just kind of shatter everyone with shrapnel, like cement shrapnel kind of yeah. thing knock and probably scrape up a few people, but maybe nope. not murder That's everyone. Right, but, you know, air burst, so it would just explode bit... within the door, or right. like through the door frame. There's someone hiding around the corner. I go one, review the room. And we've got a elite guard, two regular archers, and a regular shaman. Yeah, at least it's not a golem. That is true. One, four, the guard is five. Not that it matters since he's the last one. I did not Oops, see what the shaman was. Spot. Shaman is three. Also, it wouldn't really matter because he's the only one. Just put it somewhere. That's true. <laughs> Stick shaman it anywhere. Is move attack mobilizing. Just guard like is attacking says to range. You. And the archer is also... Okay. Um, right. Archer. One, oh, two. Oh, honey, just stick I'm it anywhere. I'm still not done yet, sir. I'm going to use the top of this. Attack six. Stun wound. I don't have light, unfortunately, so it's just attack nine. Advantage times two, so that's 18. Does he have uh, extra health, or is he just an elite one? He's just, just, just a dude. All right, I one-shot him. It's just he's the target of the orchid. Which means that, special about him. that uh, guy is not going to move anymore. Wait, 
I thought the shaman was the target. Oh, is the shaman? Yeah, the shaman's the target. Ah. He killed the guard, the elite guard. Well, that's all I could reach, so here we go. I mean, doesn't... I don't even remember what happens if we kill the target. He just stands still? Yeah. Yeah, because he just moves towards towards the shaman. Okay, so well, we have... Towards the dead shaman, he stops moving. Yeah, we have like three turns before he even thinks about getting that close. Okay, the shaman's yeah, he... going to attack me for three damage. Miss. I am immobilized, though, so I'm not much help next turn. Um, the guards are dead. Throw then... your hammer. What am I? A paladin? Uh, so then the archer's going to attack me for three damage piece. Are they range on me? Range three? Yeah. Yeah, okay. I was talking more Thor. Four. Four. So two, three. Um, so I take a damage, and then the other one for three. Did you guys ever read the... I'll take another damage. Did you guys ever read the Forgotten Realm series books? No. I think you've asked no. us that. The name sounds familiar, sure. but... Well, I mean, it's pretty big. I mean, they're essentially D and D books, like what D and D to kind of like hand in hand. Uh, Europe, Kyle. I've asked about Unforgotten Realms. Maybe that was animated. I, I, have, I have not read. I have seen some of Unforgotten Realms. Okay, I've not seen anything of. Well, anyways, anything. there's a guy in the book with a returning hammer. He throws the hammer and it returns to him. It just was relevant in this situation because you would throw the hammer. It wouldn't come back. <laughs> so therefore relevant. Shut up. One, two, three, four. Everything's out of range. That's my turn. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed it. All right. And I'm up. Yeah, there we go. Okay. And then I will go. I'm going to immobilize an enemy. Kyle, you're immobilized. I'm going to use Three. my mana potion. Okay. And then I will use the top of detonation. I'm not sure what element I want. <laughs> I just realized it was sitting there and I wasn't using it. Do that. So we good? Mm -hmm. Alright, uh, the slate moves up. And that's the round. Okay, so... I'm going to... I'm going to short rest. I guess for all the ones I'm looking at, it doesn't matter what I generate. So there's that. And I can't move this time, which kind of sucks. But then I think I'd rather do this. At least I can attack something. Well, okay. So let's see. I am going to attack something. I don't know what, but probably a shaman. So this guy quits moving. What you doing, Kyle? Yeah, you know, just, just thinking. Oh, oh, oh! There's a little bit of a leg. All right, we're good. Fifteen. Fourteen. Nine. Of course you would. All right. 
it's you, then me, then the archers. Do me Guys, a we're on the same team. You don't need to fight each other for who <laughs> kills the things. And then shooting out the shaman for two plus two. Minus two plus two. Plus two. So six damage. All right. He's down to four. All right. Is that all you got? Yep. That's, that's two cards. All right. I'm going to shield retaliate top and then burn the bottom of this for a five damage. Range three. I'm going to attack the shaman. He takes two damage on each of his turns. I'm going to attack the shaman. <laughs> hey, look at that. Times two. And a generator light. So shaman is dead. Worth. Worth indeed. And then my immobilize goes away. Okay. The archers go. Archers go. They both attack me for two damage. Three damage, so nothing. And two damage, so nothing. Good. And then they both create a trap. Yup. I'll just grab a couple from back here. No, uh, not well. They're definitely gay, but okay. And then Kyle. All right, I'll go one, two, three, four. I like just hovering above your traps. That's really <laughs> all this is. I'm not if touching get, them. If you get uh, so an enemy not to weird. touch it, if you get an enemy to touch it, I gain XP. Probably won't happen because they're archers and they're not going to move. And I don't have pulls. Um, so I'm going to attack five, to both targets. One. I'm going to use fire. Just in case. Plus kills one. Right, so, so first attack one. six on each. We have eight damage. Eight Two damage. Left. Okay. And a fire, so six damage. Six damage. And okay. I get my fire back. I also generate fire and ice. So I really didn't want to draw fire. That was the worst one. The worst around. Okay, uh, then the slave doesn't move because there's no target. And end of round. Right, I'm going to do short rest. Nope. I've taken three hit points of damage, all due to not trying to lose cards. <laughs> Best. Around. Oh, yeah. So, how many leak kills do you get this time, Kyle? One. Just one? Okay. Mm hmm. You guys should exhaust. <laughs> Oh, we'll get I right can, on I that. Can, I can wait a while. Everyone just stop attacking for a while. But I want to get coins. Okay, then go get coins. I will get coins. There's, there's coins all over here. Start running around. But put coins in front of me. Oh, those coins I'm taking. Well, then I'm not going to exhaust. I'm still taking the coins. <laughs> He sure showed you. you. You've only got one card, Kyle. I see that. Okay. <laughs> I'm I was just sure if you were waiting for us or what you were doing, so. Oh, definitely just deciding what to do. Nine. Yeah, Seven. You're up, Pat. I told you I was going to go before you. Uh, but you don't have a loot, so get the further one, please. Let's go and shoot archer number one. Five base damage. Six damage. But then I can't attack, and I can't burn this card, and I can't exhaust it. Go for the further one, please. I only have five movement. Ugh, you asshole. <laughs> I only have three movement. Yeah, so you can reach this one. Yeah, I, I can also reach this one right here. I can't reach that one. <laughs> exactly, I get more coins this way. You said you weren't going to exhaust. Well, if I can get this coin, then I'm going to get the coin. See? You're not exhausting that. 
I have to well, get hit. Made it more last. difficult for me to exhaust, so no, I'm not spending seven turns exhausting. Well, you can just step on, like, no, I guess you can't step on traps. No, it's kind of difficult for me to tra step on traps. Thank you. We'll just go run up next to that archer. He'll kill you real quick. Well, only why'd you run points. forward? I said you could run forward. What was I your said, speed why'd you do? Otherwise, I was going to be the target. I'm invisible. I'm invisible. About time. What? You're 17? I'm 17. Okay, you're up. Cool. I'll turn on my thing. Give me true experience. Woo! Racking up experience. And then I can't use my infernal for vortex. Because there's nothing within range. Alright, I'm grabbing a coin. And then... Yeah, I'll just do that. Okay. Alright, uh, the archer's gonna go. Should attack me for two damage. Why, for why'd zero. you step forward? <laughs> and then I'm gonna be discarding these two cards to prevent the damage. Which means I will be exhausted this turn. Literally trying to die. And can't. Well, I, either way, I would exhaust. Actually, I don't, I don't think I can technically cancel it because it's zero. Because I didn't take any damage, but I will be have to. I will have to short rest. I will well, lose a health can, and then discard you two can cards lose instead. Card, lose, not activate your armor. No, he did damage. zero damage before shield. Oh, he did hit zero yeah. damage. Um, yeah. So anyway, so technically, I will be short resting, discarding two cards to prevent that damage, and then I, and then I'm exhausted. So there we go. Technically. And flip. 46. 56. And the archer. 14. 14. He's going to shoot a Kyle. Shoot a Kyle for two damage. One damage. And okay. a trap. And which doesn't affect another us. Another trap. Alrighty then. Yeah. Okay. Then you're 46. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to doom him. I don't think there are any elements, are there? No. And that's all I can do. There is no summoned ally nearby. Well, if you'd gone after me, there would have been. <laughs> I, I went as slow as I could with that com combo. Okay. Um, so I'm going to heal myself. I'm just playing to exhaust with cards anyways, so I guess I could heal you. It really doesn't matter who I heal to get one experience. And then I'm going to summon my doppelganger. He will last long. What's his... He doesn't have an attack? Nope. nope. Okay. He's just a beat shield and I can cast spells using him mm -hmm. as the source. Alright, end of round... Uh, so I'd need a short rest. Just keep playing these two. You don't want to just exhaust this time? Hmm? I said you're not just going to exhaust this time. I can't? You can. You can lose one health to prevent the damage and then discard two cards. And then you'd be down yeah, to one. Yeah, discard two cards from your element. Uh... Discard pile. Yeah. Because that was the other one I wanted. No, it doesn't, that doesn't matter, I guess. I really wanted that card. Okay. You get to wait one more turn. Nah, I've already got him on the Yep. 31. I'm going to go for 36. 32. <laughs> okay. So, Pat. Uh, let's go with a move. And 
that will be all. Okay. Then the archer's gonna go. Take a step back and whack Pat for four. Oh no. Five. Five whole damage. I'm down to nine. And then Kyle. Then Pat failed to kill the main summon. target. What's your summon's move too? So he'll go here. Two. I oh. failed to kill the main target? The remaining target. I don't want to kill it. You want to next turn? Yeah, next turn I, I'll kill it. So that was. Oh, you're making the joke. I thought you were saying that right <laughs> now that I failed to. Ah, yes, you are making the joke. It's it's kind of impossible for me to fail. Yeah, well, I'm going to heal myself with three more. Another experience. I heal myself using my my doppelganger to target myself. <laughs> Since that's the only time I'll actually ever use the damn doppelganger. Right. Actually, no. It says you can only. It only says you can perform attacks. I can't perform heals using him. Correct. Anyways, short rest, discard. One card can't go. I get attacked against. Kyle is dead. Oh, okay. That already happened. That already happened. That's right. So you're up. Pat. You only attacked and attacked you. Yep. Even if it had tried to attack me, it would attack my doppelganger because it was in the uh, way. Flip. Got 68, so you're up. Alright. So let's start off with a 2 plus 2 plus 2 attack at this that advantage. So a plus 2 or a Miss. <laughs> So let's go with 8 damage. Alright, he's dead. Alright, that gives me another one of these. And then I assume you're just going to move and get the coin. And I'm going to move and get the coin. Alright. There you go. You got two exhaustions. Are you happy? Woo! Just doubled how many I had. <laughs> Battle goals. Mine was to end with three or fewer cards. I did that. I needed sure. to overkill an enemy. I didn't. Over only short rest, which nice. I did. All right. What a difficult <laughs> one for you what? to achieve. <laughs> with your fucking monster hand. All right, what is the flavor cards. text? Only. With the last thing he knocks and the golem's dead, the orchid drops his sword and falls to his knees. Thank you, he says. They killed my family when they came. They said my children were not strong enough workers. The orchid dips his fingers in a pool of blood and begins to paint his face with, face with it. I thought killing them all would help, but I still feel hollow. I owe you a debt for what you have done. I will gladly lead you into, a, into the western forest. Scenario 50, 48. On the way, however, I would like to check on a neighboring Orchid village. I fear that they may not be the last of the slaving Enoch's tribe. Uh, that's scenario 44. Uh, the Orchid stands and turns to face you. Uh, turns to you, his face now a red mask of ferocity and hatred. I am called Redthorn. Follow me. So, new locations. Tribal of the South, uh, number 44. Shadow Wheel, Wailed, Wailed. Uh, Wailed? Scenario 48. Uh, party achievement, Redthorn's aid. aid. And reward, plus one reputation. Congratulations. Hey, we made it to eight. Made what to eight? Eight, eight, prosperity. Oh, no, you said reputation. Reputation, yeah. I, that was a really slow brain <laughs> process there. I'm ready for reset. Oh, boy. Uh, let's see, I got 16 coins. Six, Jesus Christ. Oh, I see. Gotcha. As in total. Got it. Gold, not coins. Got it. I got 16 four. and 22 experience. How much 22. is the base experience? 12 at this level. Oh. Ah. Okay. I'm ready for reset. All right. Loading, loading. So 16, loading, dying. System is crying. How much did we lose for that uh, road event? It was five, five, right? Yep. 
I think we did that before saving. Correct. Nope. No, we didn't. Okay. No. You need to take it out. Yep. Did. So okay, so we got... Hey, we're back up to running fives. Slave pen. Oh, no, we're not. Not until Kyle hits eight. Could be a little bit. I'm not 77, 44. Still got 27 to go. And 48. 44, 48. So do you want to try the boss? The boss? What boss? The next boss, or the next... I'm uh... the boss. My name's the boss. Um... The shadow wheel is uh, a boss. Well, if I want to go help his people. Then we can do that. <laughs> I'm going to buy two blesses, Pat. I should probably also do such things. I got nothing better to do with my gold there as well. Wow, three. Nice. Oh, and then did you get your uh, item, Pat? Yep, I already did all that. Okay. Where's the blessed deck? Down Over here. by us. Alright, let's try out this new split feature. Where the hell? Split feature? Stream marker. Here we go. So do you want to do the boss or you want to help all the people? Doesn't matter to me. Okay. We'll Let's do the boss. We'll do the boss. 48. Forward progress.